What's up guys? We are back with part two of Miracle Warriors on the Sega Master System. We're here on December 4th, 2023. Almost makes me 41. So last episode, we uh what do we do with Miracle Warriors? Lots of grinding. Found out that weapons are uh you buy them, then they get used up kind of like in Diablo. I got the mask. The mask. And I went to the cave, and after that, it was... That was pretty much it, right? So I didn't get any new characters or anything. But let's play this, because you know what? It's actually a pretty decent game. I won't say... Should I say good? It's actually good. Well, I can't say that it's amazing, but it's good. It's better than... Games that I played on the Super Nintendo, Genesis, PlayStation, PS2, you know, it's... It's got a certain charm to it. So, uh, let's see. Does continue work? I don't think it, it does work. Uh, okay. So, I can save this way, too. But uh, I didn't save this way. I got to careful because it always starts off on the save state. So, I saved this way. And I was in the cave. So, that's where I was. You know what? I'm going to turn up the volume a little bit. <clears throat> playing some Pokemon Stadium 2. Still trying to finish that. It's taking forever because the stadium part is so boring. Oh, this music is good. So you see, that's my dude. My dude is there, and I have three herbs left, and I gotta get through this. If I remember how to get out. So I'm thinking I won't be fighting much. Just like that, or else I won't be able to get out. Gizilla. And whenever uh, I get through parts where I am good, I will save. Tell you guys, this game is pretty decent. Is that why I went in there for the horns? You know what? I'll come back, okay? Since I actually made it through, I'll come back. That was pretty good. Thought I was gonna die. With these old games, man! If you go through a stupid dungeon, you don't know what's gonna happen. You're going to end up dying. So, uh, I will be using a map. Because this, this game is nuts. So, um, give me a moment here, actually. I could, I could do it right on the screen here. It would, it would be better. Because I found out last time, uh, you need a map. Because the game doesn't let you kind of, like, expand out. Which is a huge problem. I'm guessing something like this would have come with a map. So I cannot remember everything. Oh, right there, perfect. Oh, this is so nice, not using the phone. Okay, so where I am... Okay, I'm at the dick shape cave here. Oh, okay, okay. See, I'm, I'm close to the middle of the map. And I need to get... I, I know where I need to go, okay. Let's 
close this. Uh, I still have a cold. There's a castle in there, right? That's where we're gonna go. Welcome, warriors. How fare the old thy sojourn? Haven't ye enough fangs? Bring me more next time. Oh, I think I need like five more fangs. Okay, then where's the city where I can go and heal? It's so this game, you gotta go to a city to heal. Okay, so on this continent, everything is really close by, which is nice. So what I'll do, I'll uh, I'll save. And, and I'm almost leveled up here. This is great. Actually, that should be enough fangs. Go. Mocha Mao fare thee. Thou art truly worthy. Yeah, five fangs I was missing. Worthy of the name warrior. Except the axe of... Ayansun as reward. Seek elsewhere the arms of Ayasan. Iris's axe, such a fine blade. Uh, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Save. Wonder if I just have to go to the cave for the fangs. I got no clue. Um, yeah, so. God, these buttons, there's two buttons and I can't figure it out. That's where I was supposed to go. Oh! Oh! So now I have the axe. Okay. Here, and then I can go items. So I got the mask there. So I gotta repair those, right? Armor always costs five grand to repair. Okay. Well, let's heal. I'm pretty sure that's the heal place. Yeah. So healing, going to the inn, always dependent on the amount of HP you are missing. So let's just fight a little bit and then gain a level up here. We're almost there. So I'm 90 points, right? On my axe. Oh, that's actually pretty damn good axe. So. Status. As you see, the usage on the axe goes down, right? So you don't want to let it break from what I've... What I've been told. I could probably buy a helmet or shield or something. Ouch. You're avoiding my hits? Piece of crap? Oh, these guys are giving me money, okay? They're giving me fangs on and money. That's good. That's really, really good. Just having a... Uh, Monster Zero Extra Peachy Keen Energy Drink here. Now I'll take one of my lozenges. So, this is the second Master System game I'm playing on stream and. You know what? The Master System is pretty cool console. It was my first console. I did ignore it for a good portion of my life, but um, I've come back to it. I 
I definitely want to explore more games on it. Come on. How the hell are you missing? So then there really isn't a point in... in having your weapon break. If it breaks, it breaks. You still get back the same thing. Unless if it's the ISOM, the, the one that I got there. But I'm gonna do some tests here. I don't wanna go back yet. Good. Ah, oh, still not leveled up. Oh well, I'm gonna end up dying here. Wrong one, isn't it? Yeah, it's this one. It's, it's the green building. Okay. Yo. Hey Dave, what's up, what's up, how's it going? Dave says, back to Miracle Wars, no more Dragon Force, just mixing it up. Mixing it up. How's the volume, how's everything? Um, I kind of had this game on my mind, so I thought, hey, might as well play it. I mean, I could go back to Dragon Force anytime. It's a nice thing about having a, a lot of options, right? Game volume is quite low, gotcha, okay, no worries. test here yeah I turned it up a little bit little bit by little bit that's that's how you gotta go with this game it's better okay cool awesome yeah so I uh, I exited the cave I got a bunch of fangs I don't know if, what what's the point of that cave but I exit it and I got the axe uh, here I'll sh yeah. I can't go menu in the village apparently check it out I got the uh, iris axe or iosome axe or whatever Yeah, it's it's pretty good. I'm gonna try to repair it in town while not saving. Dave says just gotta find your second character. I will. That's the goal right now. After I, I level up here, it's kind of hard going around with one character. Dave says he's at that ocean city where you use that spell. Oh, okay. Very cool. Who'd avoided my attack, really? Hope we level up. Yeah, hell yeah. Okay, cool. Okay, so now I'm gonna save okay so is this how I can I repair my axe is that how it works because there's no option there okay let's try it out say not sufficient I son's own is not sufficient ok 
can I repair it? Oh well. Six grand for a shield, huh? Cool, we got the shield, guys. Look at this. We're all souped up now. Okay, I'm ready to adventure. Now for the for the ocean city. What was the ocean city? Ocean city. So I'm just looking at the map right now, and where I am. I'm off four. I'm on Orc Village. Where I use a spell. Is it north? I think it's Kosaba Village. Okay. Running away is pretty easy. This has to be it. Okay, cool. I'm definitely beating up this guy. Lots of money. Ah, his name is Die. Die. Pick a die. I am the Sage Kosama. The seal of the Dark Lord is it. The seal is guarded by General Theridan. Terrarin. To reach Terrarin, thou will require three companions. These three of ancient lineage can help thee. They do not realize their old power. Parkal, awaken giant. One is in a town which prays to the god of the sea. Oh, that's what Dave says. Where I use that spell, okay. Garia Village. Where is Garia Village? That was a second town. Next village is Kadia village. Kadia, Kadia. Blue everywhere. You know what? It's actually not that far away. Okay. Let's go there. Oh man, my son got me sick again. It's the only way that I ever get sick. Do I not even take damage? <sighs> oh shit, no. I just want to retreat. Okay, so now I'm here. I kinda gotta go southwest here. Kaida? Florida? So I just pass that. Go west until I hit a river. And then south. I am surrounded, oh no! Thou must crush your enemies. See them German before you. Hear the lamentations of the woman.
This has to be it. Oh, cool. Thou hast found the helm in the cave? No. What the hell is that? No, no cell fags. No donation. Status? For port status? Oh, that's to see my status. Okay, to see what uh, items I have. Whatever. If thy fave is small, villages may refuse thee. My fame. My fame is impeccable. Many of us have fallen to the minions of evil. Well, awake giant. This is my character. I am Guy. I have waited long for thee. Here is one portion of the ancient scroll. Complete the scroll, and the location and the seal of the Dark Lord will be clear. Let us search for our second companion. Oh, yes! I got a character! Look, he's all leveled up! She is said to be in a town to the far south. Yes! We got a character! Yes! I'm not all alone anymore! Look at this! There's two of us! Yes! Apollo, how's it going? What's up? I got my second character, Guy. Who's a guy? Isn't that amazing? He's a dude and his name is Guy? I never would have thought. So I gotta go, uh... I gotta go get some items for him. Yeah, let's heal. Well, healing is gonna be more expensive now, but I can deal more damage. Paul says, I'm excited I might have my first date light with Hayden if his dad says yes. Is that a say yes? If my son was like, hey dad, I got a date. I'd be like, good, good. And I would teach him. <laughs> I would teach him what to do and what not to do. But that's good news, yeah. Paul says, yeah, his dad is strict. That's good. That's gotta be strict. That's, that's how we set boundaries, right? For kids. No boundaries means kids become hooligans. <sighs> oh, it says I'm hyper for Friday. Lies. Cool. So, okay, look. Check that out. Guy has a... Uh, he's got a sword, though. Awesome. Let's get him armor. What are you guys gonna do? What's what's the plan for the date? When I when I went on dates in high school, it was uh, you know like movie theater, park. Uh, what was it? Like McDonald's or something? <laughs> no money, right at that time.
So, Paul says bowling and maybe go back to his place for some fun in his room. <laughs> you said that part out loud. Yeah, yeah, bowling. I remember that. Okay, so I'm supposed to go to the south. Village 13. There's Argo Village. So I just gotta go east and then south. So I found out that I'm actually able to save like this. Which I'm gonna save multiple ways. Oh, look at this, I got two characters! Oh, I can just keep choosing the attack with one dude? Well, I'll just pick Guy from Lawal then. A terrible storm is raging. What the fuck does that mean? Traveler. Paul says, what's the worst that could happen? His little brother walk on us acting like rabbits. <laughs> Magic items are used to fight strong beasts. Okay. The fuck is that? Look at that! He's huge! Uh-oh. I don't want to fight him. Oh shit, he's whooping my ass, look at that! Let's just reload. Follow says, scared, hashtag scared little kid. He'd be like, eeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
So it's basically north of here. We got to cross the river with a bridge. Paul says his little brother be like, what's the white stuff and why she's screaming like mommy and daddy? Oh, what? <laughs> you got to you gotta pervert a mind there. Because you're, you're a girl, right? And you're saying these kind of stuff? <laughs> That's not good. You can think that. <sighs> and and you're a, you said you're a minor, right? So, um, yeah, if you write stuff like that, I'm just not going to read it. <laughs> So you see how, how experience works? Whoever attacks gets the experience. It's not like I attack and then both of them get it. So might as well just attack with Guy since his sword is just a regular old sword. That, that way I don't have to use that cool ass I got. Paul says, yes, but in my state, you have to be 16 to have sex without parents giving that okay. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's a gray area for sure. I just thought it was 18, and in Canada, I'm pretty sure it's like the, the legal age is 18, but I heard with parents' consent, which is, I don't know. Kids, kids can do whatever they want as kids, right? Like, as in, kids can do kid stuff. I'll leave it at that. Ugh. Maybe I should fight. This guy is. text so I do have herbs yeah I got two herbs left I wonder if I could carry more herbs since I have another dude with me so I don't know okay I don't understand one thing in a battle, since I have two characters, when the enemy attacks, the enemy attacks both of us, right? Hits both of us. I'm guessing it could miss, but that's beyond the point. So, it attacks both of us. But if, let's say, Guy attacks, only Guy gains the experience point. It's not, um... It's not symmetrical, right? It's totally not. Look at that, just like that. You see that? I'm gonna save here. So up north here, there is a... There is a castle. <sighs> Leave me alone, man. I want to go in this castle. What is this castle? Welcome, warriors. How fair the... On thy sojourn. Maybe sojourn is journey? Having to eat enough fangs, bring me some more next time. Oh, so fangs are an ever required item. Okay. So I killed. So that's weird. I read the text box. It said only guy dodged it. But I thought the enemy attacks both. Once Dave gets here, I'll I'll ask him the um, the mechanics of the game. Look at that! Only guy took damage. I definitely want to fight those lions. They give uh, they give some fangs, but 
best of all, they give tons of experience. I just gotta find this. Ah, this place. Heal. So we gotta get really, really buff. Oh, I can get more herbs that... <gasps> you see that? I got... I bought the seven herbs. I accidentally bought herbs. I mean, that's fine. That's really good. So... I'm guessing every five character of these... Or every character needs five herbs. So now I can have ten herbs. Maximum. Herbs heal it, right? Save. More saving. I'm kind of disappointed at how experience and combat work, how it's split up, it means this game is gonna take way longer than I thought, okay. Now, let's go to the shop, then let's buy our, uh, our guy a shield. Oh, wait, how much is it? Ye have no such thing. Do not pester me. See that? 20 bucks. Hold on, hold on. I'm going to do some tests here. So a guy could not buy a shield. Does it have to do with charisma? Let's save. Oh yeah, okay. So, status. I'm just going to check status here. Shield is 59. You know what I realized? I shouldn't have got that axe until I lost my sword. Because uh, the axe replaced the sword, and I had used my sword halfway through, and it cost me five grand. So it was a. Um, I basically spent a wasted 2,500. Oh my god, what the fuck is this? What? What's that? Is somebody fucking texting me? If they are, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna mute my phone. It's, it's, it's so annoying, man. I never understood people... When... People text me. I don't know if a lot of people do this, but... They'll text like one word at a time. One word text, one word text, one word text. It's not like a concise paragraph text where everything is said and then read through multiple times, then sent. <laughs> it's kind of my pet peeve. So, he's repairing. Watch. Yeah, he's repairing. Sword? Guy? Yeah, repairing is way cheaper. Way, way cheaper. Okay, let me try to grind more money and then see if I can buy a shield for Guy. Perfect. 
So yeah, there's no way to uh, repair that axe then. That's it, I'm gonna lose the axe. Maybe I'll ask Dave again and then he knows. You're seeing this, the enemy is only fighting guy. Let's go heal him. Kadia. So yeah, like they were saying, the purpose of this game is grind one, right? And get items. Hit caves. And in caves, I guess I get uh, fangs and items and more, more level ups. Then go to the next story. So it's like rinse, repeat process, right? Over and over again. Yeah, I want to get that shield. I think I'm, I'm almost done this cold. Getting through this cold. Okay, we're not supposed to kill these guys. They're actually good guys. Alright, talk. A sacred nut. There's a sacred nut, guys. A sacred nut. And staff of earthquakes are valuable in combat. A sacred nut. Well, as dudes, that's where we get all our strength, right? From uh, from our, our sacred nut. Right? So combat is, I get to choose who to level up. That's it, just 10 fangs? Then there's no point in fighting anybody else except these lions, because they give 5 fangs, and they also give 3k money. Look at that. Terrible storm has happened. I'm doing this because I want to get that stupid shield, right? Where the pump up guy even more. Yeah, he won't sell it to me. Uh, maybe I don't meet a requirement or something. I don't know. So what I'll do, I will um, save multiple times. Black Monk. Let's talk to the Black Monk. Art thou is up the what motherfucker? <sighs> Whatever. That's just as I'm saving that asshole just just appears like overpowered monk and just hits me and beats me up. So I should be doing something. I should be going somewhere. I should be. Hey, remember that castle I went to? The next part of the game that I can go to is actually. Uh, this is eleven. What is a eleven? Minos Village. Okay, there's a village. There's Swordsmith Village. Okay, why don't we check out Swordsmith Village? So that place I went to, right? just before this, that castle. Oh my god. Don't even talk to that asshole. And this asshole. Oh my god. Oh my 
God, he's whipping my ass. This game is merciless, so don't kill these guys. They don't give anything. Oh my God. Look at the damage. So, if I try to run, I get both characters get hit. Oh, that's what it is. Okay. Uh-uh. Fucking monk. That evil monk. Busting me up. Okay, so we go straight west. And a little bit south, and there should be a, a thing. Oh, come on. Oh, my God. Look at that. Holy shit. Did I try fighting it? Oh, no. Zap has been put to sleep. Zap did not go to sleep. Zap still sleeping. What? Whatever guy's gonna fight. That guy did not go to sleep. This motherfucker puts us to sleep? I was killed. See, I'm never gonna allow that to happen. A character gets killed, then I have to go apparently to this temple and pay thousands of dollars to get him revived, okay? Why would I do that when I have save state? <laughs> now, if I had this this game in actual cartridge, I'm playing this on the, on the uh, Mega Everdrive, right? On my Genesis. Let's say if I had the cartridge, I would have to play the with the Sega Master System con uh, Converter because my Master System does not have uh, as good of as a, as a output as this. So if I played it on the Master System, I would have to go through all that or just reload, right? God, these guys are fuck their assholes, man. Yeah, let's just go heal. I didn't want to do it, but I had to. That stupid monk. What a douchebag. He made me... He made me waste, what, like 600 bucks? 700 bucks. Uh, on top of that, I lost some... Uh, some durability on my shit. What a dickhead. Just quit. <laughs> so every time that I run, I'll, I'll save, or every time I battle. So you see, when I retreat and miss, both characters get hit. If I fight in battle with a character, the character fighting gets retaliated. So that's a little bit more fair. Ah, shit. Whoops. I loaded. Oh, uh. Save. Mighty Traveler. Merchant guy. To awaken thy second companion, Damas, put them in armor and cast a spell. Put armor and cast a spell. Okay. You know that end phase of a cold where you got like all the phlegm left over and you try to just get rid of it? That's where I am right now. Ugh. Goddamn asshole. It was a weak cold, though, this, this ass cold. Oh, shit. This is the first time I've been sick since I got the uh, uh, double coup. 
in the course of two years. Good. Save. Okay, and there is a village around here, actually. So this village is uh, straight to the west. Imagine trying to memorize this in your mind. So if I play this every day, I would have a mental map of what is where, right? It's it's something I've been gifted, right? With playing video games. But I don't play it every day and I go to work and shit. So this hamlet, hamlet means a small village, uh, is the swordsmith village. The elders have kindly asked thee to depart. Really? Well, fuck you. Still gonna save because uh, we're gonna go places for here. We're gonna go to. We're gonna go north. Vito's village. There's also twelve, which is there's Minos and Menos, like like Menos. That stupid little fish. If I go around here, yeah, I'm not fighting these guys. They don't give anything good. Yeah, right there, okay. Okay, good. We're here. Welcome to Milos. How fair thy travels. We fared pretty good. It was tough getting here. Thank you for asking. Uh, so, shield. I wonder if I can get the shield from guy. Yeah, I wonder why he says this. Ye have no such thing. Do not pass me. Hold on, hold on. I think I get it. Because I went to... There's a blacksmith that sells you weapons and armor. Then there's one that repairs it. Gotcha. That's how it works. Okay. Hast thou been trained with the sword from the king in the village by the desert? No. Look, you see this? Okay, I think this is where I buy it. That there's the repair. Okay. Really? Okay, let's let's go see. You see that? His axe got repaired. That's how you do it, guys. That's how you do it. Okay, I gotta figure it out. I gotta figure it out. And this is very good news. Then I gotta take a small break here before I come back. Okay, so stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. We'll be back.
So guys, come check me out on Twitter. If you don't follow me on uh, X, formerly known as Twitter, come check me out. Because I speak about different things than I do over here, right? It's more so my, um, you know, when I got five minutes here, five minutes there, I'll go on there. And post some, well, I don't really post. I do mostly replies. I post one on Jim Barney, uh, Ernest, right? Which was, uh, I love that actor. Uh, yeah, so we're back. Um, yeah, come, come check me out on X. It's a great platform for um, free speech. So, it's not broken, okay. Shield. Yeah, so this is how I repair. I got it. I understand. Fully understand this right now. So, obviously, repairing is way cheaper than rebuying a whole new set of uh, gear. Okay. Cool. Very cool. Now, well, let's explore the village. Yeah, I'm really digging Twitter. Ever since Musk bought it, um, the community notes is it's beautiful. It, it, it exposes the media for their BS with... Um, you saw a lot of it with, let's say, uh, fudging numbers and how well movies are doing, video games are doing, and committee notes will just ruin that, right? And when these um, when these news outlets are trying to lie about things, this is great. And I find Twitter is the best place for news. So, um, I'm speaking with someone about something, and they'll tell me, Hey, did you hear about that? I go on Twitter, boom, it's right there, right? Feather, what the hell is this? Dave, Dave says, you found guys, sweet. Yeah, so, I, I figured out a lot of things. There is a equipment store, then there is an equipment reforging store. So there's two types of stores. So I got my guys fully equipped, and yes, I can repair the axe. So I got to go to the re equipment reforging store, right? So there's a feather here. What is this feather? A feather returns to the town of its origin when... Oh, it's kind of like a, a, a grass. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. A grass from Shiny Force. Uh, which could be useful if I'm stuck somewhere, right? And I don't want to die. Face not alone the fierce and desert beast. So where I found Guy, to the right there's a skeleton boss, and I can't beat him yet. He's too strong. But apparently the other character is down south of there. I'm praying that our land will see peace. No, I'm not selling fangs because I found the other a castle where I gotta get fangs. I'm guessing it's 300 fangs. And I'll get a dope piece of gear. It says, keep going. You're right on point with the story of Madison. Yeah, it's it's a cool game, man. I'm not crazy about the combat. Uh, so combat is, if I try running away and I fail, enemy hits both my guys. In combat, experience is not spread out. It's whoever hits the enemy gets the experience and it's it's like I hit the enemy with guy enemy hits guy it's not like zap and guy hit the enemy enemy gets one hit we get two hits it's not like that it's not unfair all right Dave says it's like dragon warrior one but without spells yeah okay it is like dragon warrior yeah yeah, yeah. I see that Okay, and I'm using a map, obviously, because the game's an asshole. And where I am right now, I'm in Nino's Village. So I'm on the western part of the map. And uh, I'm going to go up north. So I'm going to go northeast here.
Most of these enemies are... There's no point in fighting them. So don't go in the cave, go here. This is the town of Meadows. No donation. So, Forge, the Forge is the repair shop, right? It's basically the mechanic of the Miracle Warriors world. Speaking of Dragon Warrior, this is a lot quicker than Dragon Warrior. Dragon Warrior was a lot slower of a game. But, uh, you could have... I've seen speedruns of Dragon Warrior. You can beat it very, very fast. I'm not sure about this. Be cautious. Slay a creature native to the caves, and thou will gain ill repute. Okay, why don't we go to that cave then? Thy wardiness to Ayasan shows in thine eyes. Yeah, you, yeah, you guys all suck. You're all talking to me. Shit riddles here. We got seven herbs. I think we're good. The leafants, leafants of Aruka's feed on sacred nuts. What the? I'm guessing a creature eats sacred nuts. the boss? Oh my god, attacks both of us? Holy shit, I barely heard it. This is fucking dope music, man. Well, it's avoiding my attacks, and I can't... I can't heal. Hey, Dave, can I heal in battle? Is it possible? Yeah, he keeps dodging my attacks. Wow, okay. Uh, definitely easier than the skeleton. The skeleton had way more HP. Come on, do I have to level up here? Guess I gotta level up, guys. Oh my god. Why are these monsters so strong? Yeah, I can't fight these monsters, man. Fuck! Okay, so... Let's go back. Let's go back to that place where I found Guy. And then we're gonna, um... Fight those lion guys. Fight some enemies that I could actually kill. Try fighting this thing. Okay, this thing's killable. So I'm guessing when, let's say, guy gets hurt, I can start fighting with main dude.
You see that shit? 16 bags. I don't even get any money. I'd rather just reload. That's what I mean. Most enemies in this game are uh, pointless to fight. There's absolutely no point in fighting most enemies. Because all they do is give fucking fangs. Yeah, sure, they give experience, but um, it, it, it would have been nice if they gave a spread of money and fangs. Okay, I'm see where I was first. Let's just talk and have this. Let's fight here. So, right now I can. Give me 10 fangs, that's it, just 10 fucking fangs. So there's uh, two things I could do here. I could grind, experience, and fangs. And then use those fangs to get another piece of armor. I'm guessing it's 300. Remember that castle I just went to about like half an hour ago? That place, right? Give fangs, man. This guy at least gives some fucking money. Let's think about it this way. How am I supposed to afford healing if I cannot make any money? Yeah, you, they just give fangs. At least I'm at a hundred right now. Yeah, just just retreat. Don't even talk to that asshole. Really, like he likes to beat us up. His smag is also useless. Oh shit, right? Oh my god. Let me run. doesn't do anything. I, I look at my health and I'm not getting hit. Okay, this guy doesn't give anything either. <sighs> so the problem with combat too is that these fuckers... There's a lot of useless enemies in the game. I need money. shop? No. That's the... the buying shop. It's the healing? Yeah. Ugh. One of the repair. This one, okay. Yeah, at least I got enough fucking money for this shit. I'm hoping to hit some of those lions. Then I'll use up my herbs. 
two of them so I can stock up to ten. Or else it's just a waste of two herbs, right? Whoop his ass, guy. That's what I need. I need money, right? I wonder how experience is spread out. I'm pretty sure it's like every other game. Right there, I killed a very weak enemy, basically the first enemy you encounter, and Guy's actually, he's got levels on him, right, and he's able to get some experience there. It's not in items. It is, and I can have more than one feather. Okay. Okay, okay. So there's a bunch of bosses that I gotta beat. Oh my god. Oh, fuck you too. These guys, I want to fight these guys. They give 3k. They're very good enemies to fight, actually. Look at that, I also got 5 fangs and 3k. The problem is, if I try running away from everything, I'll get hit. Alright, so might as well just fight everything. And the money will just average itself out. <laughs> I wonder how priority works in combat. Priority and speed. Let's go buy the herbs. absolutely nothing. Yeah, even this guy's fine. He gives money, right? Oh my god. No, he doesn't even give money. This guy's good. I kill him in two hits. Retreat! Don't fight the bad monk! Yes! Very good. So I'm halfway there. If it's 300 fangs, I'm halfway there. So I'll be able to get a, a wicked ass armor or shield next. Yeah, I gotta do a lot of grinding. That's apparently that's part of the game. Let's 
smack. Uh huh. Guy barely dodged the attack. Well, there's dodging and there's no dodging. They just give fangs. Yeah, this guy just gives fangs as well. Ouch. That guy finished it off. So how experience works from what I've seen is based on hits. It's not experience is not based on kills. It's based on hits. Okay, we don't want to kill this guy. He's a good guy. Sacred nut. He keeps telling me about a sacred nut. Dude must have some crazy ass sacred nut. I wonder how many kids bought this game and just got stuck in the game. Thy second companion can open any lock. So... Second companion. It's not a guy. They said I will be getting my second companion later, right? So it's not a guy. <laughs> Six fangs. Well, I'm almost two thirds of the way there. Oh my god, retreat. Retreat! Don't fight that motherfucker. He will be. Well, I wonder what the fairy does. What does fairy do? Yeah, more grinding. Oh my god. Let's go deal. Hold out for six fucking fangs and some experience. Give me some crumbs, please. Some crumbs of experience. Oh my god, 600 bucks to heal. That's what I mean. I, if I'm in a fight, I need, I need money. Or else how the hell am I supposed to heal? Let's look at status. Yeah, our gear is fine. So now I'm wondering because remember when I first played this Mega Everdrive? I played Final. Uh, I played Shiny Force, the ROM hack, but I couldn't save. In game, and I thought because I could have saved in game, it just didn't work. What I'm starting to understand is that it was the ROM because this works. It was, I mean, the ROM hack. Since it's a ROM hack, I wasn't able to save in game, so I use save states. This one, I could just save, and it works, which is amazing. That's the way it should be. Like, I don't want to just depend on save states. What if something goes wrong? I want to have a backup, right? Oh my god. Yes, these guys are good. He's almost getting to level up. Rike, let's go heal. So how do you elongate a game back in back in the eighties and early nineties? How do you make a game longer? 
but you're restricted with a weak console, like something like this, right? The master system. How do you do that? You make the game really, really hard. You make the game that it's hard to get experience and it takes a long time to get anywhere. That's how you do it. Because this game is not long. I, I looked at the map, it's actually pretty small. But I can't get anywhere without, uh, <laughs> without getting fucking stronger, right? Some crazy guy, how's it going? What's up, what's up? Some crazy guy says, you make the game for adults? You gotta make it for kids and adults. Equally enjoyable, right? It's raining where you are? Over here, too. And it's, it's like pouring. It's raining very, very bad. Oh my god. Guy's getting beat up. Whenever I hear guy, I think about uh, Lufia. You know, uh, Lufia 1, you meet guy and then he dies. But in Lufia 2, he's, he's part of your main team. He's a warrior dude with the blonde hair. Uh, some crazy guy says they should make World of Warcraft for adults again, too. I don't know. I never really played World of Warcraft. I mean, I tried it. Hey, we got him for 10 fangs. All that for 10 fangs. But would it sell? If a game is strictly for adults, it's sort of like doing, um... Doing a mature movie, right? 18 plus movie. Deadpool did pretty good. But then you're missing out on audience. Uh, some crazy guy says it's already R18, isn't it? I don't know. I got no clue. It's sort of like uh, if I were to make my channel 18 plus, I see people doing that. <sighs> to make it 18 plus, like what would it have to be? You'd have to, <laughs> you'd have to be an OnlyFans chick, right? On a on, on a bikini or something. Because what would you even talk about that would be 18 plus? It'd be pretty gross, right? I don't know. I think PG-13 is good. Swearing and... That kind of shit's fine. So Guy's almost getting to level up here. I'm telling you, man, in some crazy guy says you're an OnlyFans. I'm telling you, in, in the future, like, my son, I'm gonna have to train my son about how to, uh, how to spot OnlyFan girls. Right? Because there's regular chicks and OnlyFans chicks, right? It's like, do not go with the OnlyFans girls. They are, there's no future. You cannot get anywhere with them right so I think that's how it's gonna be it's gonna be uh, parents training their kids how to avoid only fan girls and then of course um, those single parent households all right those ones um, are not gonna be training their kids and they're gonna, and their kids are gonna be doing only fans because I guarantee you most only fan girls come from single parent households uh, majority right I'm not saying all but probably majority Some crazy guy says you will rake into girls. Hell no. I don't want any of those shits. Dave says the monsters in this game are cool, original. Nothing quite like him. Yeah, they're alright. I got a question, Dave. Combat question. Can I heal in combat with herbs? Or else how do I heal in combat? If not without herbs. Because uh, I can't beat the bosses without healing. But yeah, where we're going with the whole OnlyFans things, it's actually pretty fucking hilarious because we got politicians, right? We got female politicians with uh, OnlyFans applying. We got teachers with OnlyFans, and we're almost moving a certain place in the culture where this is gonna be acceptable. If it was my world, I would never fucking accept that shit. 
I'd be like, you are, you are all, like, <laughs> you're exiled, right? Stay the fuck away from the normal population, right? Well, that's where we're going with the with the culture. It's it's pretty hilarious, man. Whenever I see this in in the media, I'm just laughing. Um, some crazy guy says, but what about the ability to tell them to go fuck yourself? I'm liking democracy a lot less now. Yeah, well, this is liberalism. It's not democracy. There's a difference. Uh, liberalism is not exclusive to democracy, and vice versa. They're they're separate things. He says, I don't think you heal in combat. There are spells I've seen that now magical. Okay, so I can't heal in combat. So the only way to beat those bosses with really high HP is to have high HP myself. Okay. So crazy guy says, but they don't exist in dictatorships that are run right. Yeah, because um, dictatorships are patriarchies, right? They're run from a top-down sort of structure, while um, liberalism is not, <laughs> right? And you pair liberalism with democracy. It's it's sort of like um, think of uh, think of our society is actually if we didn't have our government in Canada, it'd be it'd be pretty close to like uh, like like caveman right so people do whatever the fuck they want so we're kind of going to a place in the world where people are doing whatever the fuck they want so i'm telling you guys we're gonna see polygamy a lot more we're, uh, we're gonna see like one dude with like 10 wives because he'll be like a fucking alpha dude and all the chicks are gonna want him and that's gonna be acceptable we're gonna see <laughs> We're gonna, we're gonna see one chick with like 10 beta orbiters. Well, I won't even say beta because that's the wrong term, but like, but like simps. Simp orbiters. Just for, for the, <laughs> for the hopes to get access. But it's not gonna be hot chicks, right? <laughs> there you go, you leveled up. We're, we're gonna see a lot more, okay? And I'm just, I'm just like taking notice of this stuff, and it's, it's funny, guys. It is so funny. Some crazy guy says ten orbiters for a mid chick. Not, not even, man. The ones I've seen, I've seen these on, uh, on like documentaries. It's like, <laughs> it's like, it's like one out of ten girls, uh, two out of ten. Just, just like the one I've seen. When I'm saying that, I'm not talking about self-worth. Don't fucking talk to me about self-worth. Uh, this is like sexual market value. So if you were to put yourself on, let's say, a dating app, what would be your your worth and on that dating app to other people, right? That's what I'm talking about. So when I'm ranking, it's like, these are like not attractive chicks with like 10 beta orbiters. But even in, in those beta orbiters, or, or I, I keep saying beta, that's, that's the wrong term. Even in those simp orbiters, there's... There's like one alpha dude in him that actually gets access to her more than everybody else, right? Yeah, it is fucked. <laughs> so crazy guys, LOL orbiters for unfuckables. Yeah, 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 pretty much, right? Bro, where we're going though, it's it's uh, it's never been easier as a dude to make money, right? Where we're going to like society. So I mean, I don't I don't think it's a bad thing. It just is, right? So we can't look at it like, oh, let's go back to the old times where it was good. We can't do that. We can we just gotta look forward. Look forward at how to adapt, improvise. That's the most important part. Okay, so I almost have enough fangs here. Some some crazy guy says I didn't have problem. Flapping cheeks on dating apps. I had a mate who used to pick up chicks with my pick on dating apps. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Okay. That's actually pretty funny. I just want to get 300 fangs here. 
Now we'll go check out that armor. See, I'm at 286 fangs. I think I need 14 more fangs just to get um, a new good piece of armor. more fangs guy leveled up and we just got to keep leveling up guys uh, it's the only thing I can do hey there we go these guys are awesome yeah what I like about Twitter is is that I'm following things that that interest me right people that post stuff that interest me doesn't mean that I agree with everything that they say it's that oh, that's that's interesting right and uh, it's similar to Facebook in a sense, but what's nice about Twitter is that you don't get fucking censored. Like, like on Facebook, you can't say retarded. Oh, what? I just bought more herbs? But on Twitter, you can. <laughs> you can say that. Okay, so herbs. Let's buy more herbs. I'm at 20? Let's keep going. How many herbs can I get? Some crazy guy says, I don't think I would be allowed to post on X. On on Facebook? Hell no, man. You would get fucking banned so fast. Because uh, face, Facebook is also politically charged where it's like... <coughs> Obviously, the moderators, they're all fucking lefties, right? So anything that that's not left-wing... I'm not saying, like, only right-wing, but anything that's opposed... They're gonna fucking censor you. So it's 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 very biased, right? It's it kind of reminds me of like Tumblr. Have you ever heard of Tumblr? It's like 4chan, but the opposite, the other side of the extreme. Oh, it won't let me carry. Okay. Yeah, the only thing I use Facebook for is I'll, I'll post like a family picture. That's it. Because I got friends and family who follow me there. That's that's all of it, man. Twitter Twitter is way better. Give, give me a follow on Twitter, man. I'll give you a follow back. Some crazy guy says, The censorship community would have, would have their face broken. <laughs> <laughs> by my fist by just looking at me <laughs> from your picture like getting browbeat by the picture so see over here I can actually repair yeah I didn't realize that for the longest time that that Facebook is just a place where you post family shit because they got groups and stuff right well why take a risk? That's what I've come to. Why why take a risk on Facebook? Because I've already lost my account. I got fucking banned off of there for calling people pussies and shit, right? On Twitter, I could call people pussies. I could call Disney the biggest pussy company out of five, right? It's great. Uh, my ex handle is is my exact same name. You could you can basically search Zafras and Talk says on on X, on YouTube. It's all the same throughout. That's that's kind of what I was going for. Yeah, uh, I don't I don't post much, but I reply 
quite a bit. So you see my replies? Ah, terrible storm, man. There we go. Okay, so that should give me enough fangs. What's up, crazy guys? LOL. If the censorship team had to face me real life, they probably would be too scared to say anything. Yeah, that's how it is, ma'am. It's like, um, let's say... Let's say you're going in a store or something. Do you do you find people talk shit to you? No, right? I'm the same way. People don't fucking talk shit to me. Rarely. It does happen. But um, it's always the opposite sex. And I was like, ignore him. There's, there's no fucking point. Ah, man. Because in real life, uh, uh, there's that threat of violence, right? <laughs> that's that's how it works. On the internet, there there isn't. This is annoying. Why aren't I able to run away with this? Some crazy guy says X must be down. I cannot search you. Uh, just, just wait a little bit. I'm sure, you'll be able to. So I'm going to the castle right now, or trying to. But um, I think I gotta update my Discord info. I uh, cleared out my history cache, and what? Oh wow. What happens is, uh, I think it resets my Discord server number so it's no no longer valid. So then I gotta regenerate another number. So how it works with, with Discord is that uh, you could either get a temporary link URL or a permanent one, right? So I always use the permanent one. But since I erased my history cache, it didn't work anymore. So I gotta do a bunch of updating. Wonder what this guy gives. Some crazy guy says, LOL, I have been to the supermarket once when some uh, not nice lady thought she could tell me what to buy for my kids. Security had me removed. <laughs> really? Did you fight with her? Dude, I just, I just, like, ignore those people. I just laugh in their face and just walk away. Because you're never going to win an argument with a woman, man. There's absolutely no point. Just, just ignore him. Or just, just to be like, you know how you treat your kids? Say, no, we don't do that here. And just walk away. Oh wow, that's a lot of money. They can go fight each other. I don't really care. I can imagine a Maori guy just <laughs> just at the supermarket fighting with security. <laughs> okay. So welcome, how fair the on thy quest. Uh, guy those noble blood flow in thy veins. A single mighty blow can remove the evil curse. Turos's sword now needs not fear. The forest of curses. Wait, did Guy just get a item? Wow, so not only main guy gets main weapons, Guy can as well. Look at that. He's got a Tora, so I believe that's the best weapon for him. Okay, okay. Some crazy guy says, oh well, I didn't tough her touch her. Or tougher she just screamed at me and then security removed me yeah because that's the easier course than that than, than dealing with Karen right oh 
Um, 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 um. Save. I'm wondering if I should be hitting the other castles. So number five, right? I've been to that castle. Now there's number number eight. So this is the second castle. Now what is the other castle? There's Elato's castle, which is 17. I don't think. I don't think I'm even close. Yeah. That's way far away, guys. Um, so I'm basically in the northern part of the map. So there's like the east, north, and northeast. So all around there. And that's the only place that I could travel. Um, let's see. Julius Monument. So, remember that that wiener cave that I was at? That, that like, dildo cave? Um, apparently there's something in there. It says Julius Monument. So, we could try going back in there, actually. Since I'm just killing monsters. So, basically, where, where I went. And then I just gotta keep going east. Some crazy guy says, yeah, I'm glad they have click and collect sometimes. What do you mean click and collect? Yeah, see, some crazy guy, we're kind of lucky, right? When when you think about it. In in America, those sort of altercations end, end with guns, right? Because <laughs> those motherfuckers have guns. But where you are in New Zealand and in Canada here, people just use their fists. Not very many people have guns. Oh my god, is this guy worth it? Some crazy guy says, oh, that's that's what you mean. He says, we can order groceries online at, at the Brigade too. Yeah, I have taken a, a life to a gunfight at one, really? <laughs> You're crazy, man. Groceries online. Uh, speaking of that, I don't like that. I've never used it. I like buying my own shit. I like seeing what I'm buying. I like looking at the dates. I don't trust the... Uh, I don't trust the minimum wage worker at Walmart gathering my groceries. Really, they missed? Dude, you're crazy. Kinda remind me of my uh, best bro's brother. His older brother was was the crazy one. We'd always hear we'd always hear his stories. Oh, right, that's your middle name, right? Yeah. You were telling me that. Some crazy guy. Oh, we actually killed this guy. I got two fags for that? That's what I mean. There's no point in fighting these assholes. Okay, so where am I here? fuck is this? Oh, I see where I am. Okay. Good. So let's save. There should be a village around here. Or a castle or whatever. <coughs> a village, okay. And now we'll go to that dildo place. Dildo cave. He sells stuff. Wait, what, 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 what? This is a smithy. I had a problem with the master. I was fired. For 12,000 guilders, I'll go with you. What? It means, do I get my permanent fucking smith for 12 grand? I don't think that's a bad idea. Okay, so I save. Let's try it out. 
I shall join you with Zaf. Wait, be here. Oh, what? Look at that dude's with me. What? Sure? I mean... Three is a merry company, right? My brother forged some fine weapons for you, Zaf. And thee take care of thy guests. Cool? Okay. Let's heal some. I mean, I got tons of money. Um, pretty much... Pretty much bought everything, right? Uh, so here's the guy says, unfortunately, the fight usually unfair when you're not allowed a gun and they, and the guy you are facing doesn't care. Yeah, well, that's, that's, that's adult life, right? Somebody, <laughs> somebody's going to always bring a gun. That always crosses my mind. It's like, if I'm gonna get in the altercation, is the dude gonna have a gun, right? So best, best to avoid those, right? Okay, so I need to go south here. Hold on, I didn't even repair my shit. Wasn't able to. Wait, all my shit's repaired. What? The smithy always repair my stuff? Is that how it works? Huh? So, because the guy says, I would rather live in a country that the law abiding citizens had a gun, but I guess that dream is for most of us. I agree, same man. I, I kind of envy uh, America's, uh, it's her second amendment, right? And it's, it's that freedom to actually defend yourself at all times. It's pretty dope. It also means you don't want to fucking fight people, right? Which is good. It also means that uh, a chick can defend herself from a guy, right? It's, I think that's really, really dope. Should I be fighting here? One fang, yeah, it's not worth it. Okay, so I think I may be able to get something here. I'm not gonna fight anything. try beating this thing. This Bebe Dragon. Ooh. Good. That's it. Four fangs? Man. It's pointless fighting these motherfuckers. Look at this. All my stuff is always healed. So how long does this dude stay with me? I bet you he doesn't stay with you the whole time. No. 
So because the guy says that is true, the missus should be able to open carry an automatic weapon. So I am free to go clothes shopping with her. <laughs> yeah, I, I totally get what you mean, right? I should be killing these weak enemies in one shot. Might as well. What's weird is most Canadians don't think like that, man. Uh, they cannot comprehend um, the American Second Amendment. Like they they think it's the worst thing ever. Uh, I think it's just ignorance. I used to think like that too, and I was, I didn't know enough. Yeah. There's nothing here. Oh, there we go. Look at this. What is this? An ancient helm. Hey, I got it. We can now read the writing in the caverns. Ancient Helm, I got it! Yes! Oh, that's so good. good. Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here, birdie. Let's line for X-Men vs. Street Fighter 2. No. X-Men vs. Street Fighter, yeah. Capcom's X-Men vs. Street Fighter. That's a great fighting game, man. Some crazy guesses. Also, why are people so ready to be offended for someone? Shouldn't you only be offended for yourself? Well, that's 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 projection. Uh, they're offended for themselves because uh, most likely they are in that in that situation. That's what I like to think. I don't know how correct I am. Ah. Yeah, I can totally bounce back between this and, uh, Dragon Force. Lots of safe stating. Safe scum all the way. Yeah, I'll kill. I'll gladly kill this dude. I'm close to the entrance. I got no clue. Believe so? I don't know. Okay, I've been here. Okay, okay. Call that a thief? Dude's got like giant ass pecs and muscles and shit like he's been working on his entire life that's a thief yeah it's like a bodybuilder in the middle of a cave Dave says hey Zeph have you run into an any enemy heap yet enemy no but check this out bro I just got um so I got uh where, where is it items so I got the helm in here, and I got a, I got a, a weapon smith. Twelve grand. Does he always stay with me? 
Steve says, try running away from heap, okay? Does this guy always stay with me? Always. So he'll, so he'll always repair my shit. Wow, that's, that's pretty damn good. He says, he stays with you and keeps your items from reducing quality. But permanently. Like, like, or do I have to get him every now and then? He says, you're fighting with the enemies, are you a wuss now? Sorta. Because, oh, there's something written on the wall. Let's see. Help thy friends with Aya San's weapons. Arms. Nave says, no, I think he stays with you forever. Really? Okay. So I don't have to worry about my weapons running out anymore. Uh, I'm in here because I didn't finish this place. I got the helmet. Apparently, I needed this helmet. Oh my god. How do I get out of here? That's a wussy hitting me right there. I think this place is how you get out of here. Oh my god. It's a random encounter, right? Imagine, um... Uh, oh, finally. Imagine, uh... A, a young kid playing this game. <laughs> You'll fucking rage quit this shit. I know where I gotta go. Remember that skeleton I fought? I gotta beat that fucking skeleton. But for that, I gotta level up. Okay, so... Where is this thing? Gotta go north. Probably do other caves if there is any other caves. Let's see, okay. So any other caves? There's boss number six there. So what is that? Number six. Boss number six. Shield of Selene. Ah, okay. Or remember where I went to that one cave on the north east continent? There, there's boss number six. I could go try to fight him. See what happens. I just gotta go north through a bridge, then east, and then southeast. Six fangs. Okay, now southeast. Problem is, 
if I don't fight these fuckers, they end up hurting me. Southeast, okay, there should be a boss around here. Hey, he gives me money, wow. That experience. So, there's a cave around here, right? A little bit more southeast. There's a boss in there. Fuck you, evil merchant. Oh my god. Oh yeah, these guys are awesome. Three grand, man. The lock on the cavern entrance prevents entry. Oh, okay. So I need my second companion. Go here. I gotcha. The fuck is this? Oh my god, how did I how did I miss? Imagine living in this world, you just walk outside, some fucked up monster just kills you. Guts you on the... On the plains, then you're dead. I got 25 fangs for that motherfucker, that's it? Wow. Okay, anyways. That sucked. always there forever oh look at my gear it's so dope so glass so glad I didn't lose my axe I would have been so pissed if I lost my axe axe broke best axe in the game it broke now you lost it forever Ugh. So, I'm gonna look at castles. Is there other castles? That's it. So, I've explored everything. I need to go to that skeleton, but I can't beat him yet. That, uh, Suicune, you know the Pokemon that I fought? The fucking Ice Wolf thing? Suicune? That boss was the easiest boss. Yeah, that's it. Well, I guess I'm. So I got a roadblock here. Go heal. Imagine if I got this this healer lady on my team. She could just come with me. And I could just pay her money to heal me anywhere. Come on, game, do that. Come on, do it. Yeah, let's go fight stronger enemies. That's bullshit. Okay, map. What's 10 again? A resurrection camp. Yeah, I don't have to go there. Ever. Let's go north or southwest. South, southwest, and then just fight there, man. 
So it's got to keep leveling up. I'm zoned in for this game. The game shall not fuck with me. I will fuck with the game. you have 10 herbs. I will be the goodest guy on this continent, in this world. Nobody shall be as good as me. So I'm killing all these monsters and my goodness is increasing. Fangs herself. I love how my characters don't even move on that top left screen. I'm just like, yeah, we're just fucking sliding across the world. Uh, uh, Dragon Force had grinding. This game's got way more grinding. Now, my only roadblock now is to level up. So what's the point of fighting strong monsters when I kill these weak ones? And looks like I get the same amount of experience from fighting stronger monsters than weaker monsters. As weak monsters. Hey Dave, I, uh, I got another question here, if you're listening. So the way combat works is, you got one character, all your characters are just one character. They take turns. is really really messed up it's probably the most messed up part of this game I'll tell you why a weak enemy can actually hurt you at least there's no criticals should be leveling up somewhere else. Oh, I'm 
I'm gonna go explore. This is boring. I used to do this shit when I was young, man. Just level grind. So boring as an adult. point here is to kill these enemies as fast as possible. This is going to take forever. Oh man, come on. Go heal. I mean, I'm gonna try to fight stronger monsters. See if I get more experience. Or else this will take forever. There's a desert. Okay, there's a desert. A lock in the cavern entrance prevents entry. Oh, a frightful howling can be heard. Yeah, it can be heard. Oh, look at that, there's another village there. The fuck is this? I don't think I could beat it. Yeah. It's all probability. So... Think about it this way. If the enemy has more life than me, I can't beat it. Because we're always training one for one. So... An enemy like this... I need multiple partners to beat it. Or I gotta be pretty fucking high level up. Oh my god, it's doing flame spells now. Yeah, I can't beat this thing. Maybe I can beat this thing. Nope. <laughs> it's too much damage. He can kill me in four hits. Watch that, you see that? But how am I supposed to fight these guys, man? It's like in South Park, make love not work rap. I gotta go around fighting fucking weak enemies. In thy second companion, thou must put them in armor and cast a spell. Okay. Talk. Can't beat these guys, man. fight the boss here, but I'm not strong enough. Maybe I can beat this thing? I don't think so. Oh, I guess I gotta be lucky to dodge. Just like that. Miss. Would have been cool if I gained life as I hit the enemy. Yeah, I see. Ouch. Maybe it will be 
kill him. Come on, motherfucker! I'm gonna fucking save this. Because I want to kill him. Little bitch! Ooh, 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 ooh. Got him. Okay. 30 fangs. I did all that for 30 fangs. So I'm all about the fangs. So from what I see, there's absolutely no point in fighting stronger monsters. Look at that, it's the border of the world. <laughs> Kinda like what, what Flat Earthers say. Can I beat this thing? I don't know. Pretty freaking strong. It's got a miss. For me to win, it's it's got a miss. Ah. I missed. Yeah, there's no way I'm, I'm winning this. Okay, I'm gonna take a quick break here, guys. Don't go anywhere. Be right back. Cool music, man. Just realize how amazing the pixels look of this game. What a SCART connection, SCART RGB, right? It's pretty damn amazing. I will say that. <laughs> On my screen, it looks a lot more fuzzy because on a CRT. Doesn't matter where I fight. Absolutely not. As long as I'm killing monsters, 
that's what matters. I'm realizing money doesn't matter after a certain point. I got more than enough to heal me for a long time, right? And weaker monsters and stronger monsters can attack you. Because there's no priority in speed in combat. So, I know level ups increase HP. Wonder if it increases attack as well. Still there. Look at that, my gear is pristine. Forever. Fun fact about um, ancient warfare. So when an army was on the move. When an army was on the move, let's say Julius Caesar's army is on the move when he's he's about to fight against Pompey, right? He's 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 like fucking moving around in Greece. Okay? I've established that. He's got... So, not just the armies on the move. The army... There, There's other dudes with the army and chicks. There's uh, obviously prostitutes, because the army has needs. That actually go around with the army. And they usually stay in the camp, right? And... Um, there's also... Uh, merchants that... Follow the army around, because think about it, if you're a merchant, you want to make some money, you go where uh, people, um, where there's supply and demand, right? The army, which is on the move. There's also uh, weaponsmiths, right? So, so when I'm seeing this, that's what I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about, this motherfucker knows <laughs> there's going to be never-ending business if he goes with me. Ah, oh, shit. Good, I got to run away. It's like I fight all the enemies here. Yeah, you'll you'd even have when I when I say merchants, right? Following following the army. So the merchant would be bringing like livestock. He'd be bringing he'd be bringing his family. <laughs> Right? Because he's not going to leave his family at home where, where he can't protect them. So it's kind of like merchants on the move, prostitutes on the move, uh, weaponsmiths on the move with the army. It's it's really cool, man. History of Warfare is it's so amazing. I love it so much. Reading up on this stuff and how, how people behaved in these times. It's crazy. So I want to even out my two guys, that's why I'm not leveling up both of them and just guy. What if I kill him? Wow, I just lost a hundred reputation. Uh, no. The little wussy merchants try to fight me. <laughs> He's like, ah, I'm hitting you with a stick, it's not doing anything.
seems that I'm gaining experience every two hits. Not fighting stronger enemies. Every two hits, I gain experience. See that? Last hit, I didn't get experience. Sure, just miss. Watch, no experience, okay? Watch, guys, gonna get experience. Oh, really? So is experience actually based on monster level? I got no clue. You got 30 grand, man. You can buy a city with that money. It would be Zap City. Where I would rule it with an iron fist. I would ward off invaders. When the barbarians come to the gates, I will protect my town. But in return, I will tax the shit out of the people. <laughs> That's just a dream. By a town. Oh my god. I don't want to fight him. I wonder if I'll be strong enough to kill that uh, Suicune Pokemon when I gain the level with both my dudes now. They're pretty close to gaining le a level, right? Yeah, I've been pay uh, playing Pokemon Stadium 2 <laughs> on my own time. Because it's so grueling. Oh my god. Being that round 2 stadium is... Oh my, it's so bad. Am I sleeping? Am I gonna die? What is it trying to do? It's trying to steal something? This fucking enemy, man. Oh, it's, it's putting... It's not stealing anything. It's putting my guys to sleep. Oh, you're getting a level! Awesome! I don't die over there. Down. So yeah, why should I be fighting that enemy? Which, like, look at what the fuck it did to me. Why should I fight that guy when I can fight weaker enemies? I get the same amount of experience. Let's level up, guy. Should be a level up now. Anytime. Oh, 
Oh my god, I keep missing. Oh my god, stop it. I just want to get a, a level up. Finally. So let's go fight the Suicune. Too bad I can't use herbs in battle. Say the same stuff. Okay, now that's sweet, good man. I may be able to kill it because look at so look at both my, both our lives is longer than his life, right? So I may be able to kill him. This is supposed to be the first boss. He also does flame! And hits both my guys at once, okay. There's no way I beat this guy, no way. Yeah. So I barely did half life to him. How much more spirits do I fucking need? Oh, like, how many more levels? That's not even half life, man. Let, let me look this up. Do I really need so many level ups in this game? Miracle Warriors tips and bricks. Things I wish I knew about Miracle Wars. Okay, um, blah blah blah. The map is vague. The games comes packaged with a oh, what a gorgeous map. Okay, bridges don't necessarily lead to death. Mountain tiles, desert tiles, forest tiles can lead to death early on. It is extremely expensive to raise party members. Saving can be done anytime, okay. You can't heal in battle, although you can heal anytime on the world map. You have herbs, on the towns, there's no options to replenish life in battle. So practically the very end of the game, because it is important to keep in mind in boss fights. Because you don't have enough HP at your level to outlast the enemy, you're stuck grinding until you do! Wow. Only one party member can attack each turn. The enemy's attack is retaliated against that individual. Trading fangs for easy cash is not a good idea, especially in late game. Find out where to get magic items and start saving up those guilders and fangs early. White spheres don't bring back the dead. You can hire a blacksmith to automatically repair weapons and armor. If you fight an enemy in the game, your smitty. If you find a specific enemy in the game, 
and Smitty gets murdered. I found this out the hard way. After defeating a Bazael enemy in a cave, I was told this. Thou hast badly injured the Black Monk and his retainer. Oh my god. Apparently this means that your blacksmith has died and is no, uh, no longer in your party. I didn't realize this until a long while later when one of my weapons radically broke. Then I had to seek retributive justice through the slaughter of many monsters that were full of guilders. Don't kill everyone you meet. Be prepared to search your search. The game is not intuitive. You need to depart from your comfort zone. Walk through mountains, trees, deserts. Do your best not to get wiped out. Caves and monuments can yield places to explore or hide powerful enemies, like Senpies or Anjays, that can destroy you in moments. Random houses in new towns are, inhabit are inhabited by your future party members. So you need to talk to every single person to recruit your party members. You must acquire special arbor shields to be able to recruit them. And this is never clear, it's stated at any time. When in doubt, take a little walk and don't be afraid to see what's around the next corner. Be prepared for some hilarious glaring language or whatever. Um, yeah, so, that answers my question. I'm stuck. Stuck as in, uh, I have a roadblock in front of me. That I cannot do anything. Till I pass this roadblock. By beating up enemies. Oh my. So, attack is not increase or level up, you only gain HP. Or maybe... Hold on, maybe attack is increased. So I'm killing these guys a lot easier. Dealing more damage. Yeah, that's good news. Oh my god. What an annoying enemy. It just delays my grinding. Isn't it? Yeah, it's hilarious. It says the enemy tries to steal consciousness. Alright? It, it doesn't say it tries to put a sleep spell on you. So the worst part is, if I had one guy, so if I had one dude, the game would be easier. Oh my god. Are my guys sleeping? Yeah, the game will be easier by one guy. So I, I, I can just press A, like. Drrr. That's why I gotta think who to, who to pump up and who to move. So, what's the purpose of having multiple characters?
Yeah, this battle takes way too long, because he fucking derps me, man. Fuck, I'm just pressing A. Oh my god! Stop missing! Dumbest enemy in the game. He goes first and puts my guys asleep. Holy shit. I don't want to fight those guys. Level up, even kill that boss. What other bosses can I fight? So there's Suicune here, and there's a skeleton, and that's it. They're the only two bosses I can fight. Man. Games that have boss, uh, boss fights cannot be explored. You need Medi alive in your party to access some of these fights. Oh my god. Yeah, this... This game is so short. Like, I've already explored almost half... half the world. But it's long because you gotta level up. That's your roadblock. says you say short but there's a lot of grinding yeah take okay take the grinding out I've already explored half the world take the grinding out this game is short so I gotta grind man come on Dave why why'd you pick a game like this I gotta do so much fucking grinding if I want to get anywhere or do anything And I got one question that was unanswered in uh, in a guide I looked. Does fighting stronger enemies give me more experience, or can I just fight weak ass enemies and gain the same amount of experience? He says you should be able to kill the skeleton. Okay, I can't kill Suicune, the the water Pokemon yet. Davis, you have Toro Sword on guy. Yeah, I got Toro Sword on guy. Dave says you don't need to level up to kill the skeleton. You need to you you need a Toro Sword, really? Oh my god. Well, eventually I would have fought him, so I would have found out. Okay, Dave says you get experience per hit no matter what the enemy. Okay, gotcha. That's all I needed to know. So now I can fight weaker enemies. Okay, I'll I'll fight the skeleton, yeah, because I just hit a roadblock, man, and it's pretty boring. Does damage increase with level ups? Oh my god, are you seeing this? I took one fucking step. This is some Breath of Fire fucking random number generator battles. Hold up. 
Yeah, I gotta go northeast. Dave says, I think you get one damage per level up. Really? Okay, what about defense? Is it the same thing? So level ups are not just HP, okay. I think defense as well increases. There's hope! I can finish this game, there's hope! So what other game do you have for me after I beat this? Because <laughs> I'm going to beat this fucking game. Some weird, obscure game that I've never heard of. Dave says, I don't think your defense raises rises except for my items. Get, yeah, you get the health boost though. Yeah, so level ups give you health and attack. Okay, which, I mean, if it was just health, that would suck, but attack is good. He says game after this, let me think. <laughs> yeah, like, this game is actually good. I would probably put it, uh, me like, mediocre. Um, mediocre RPG is good. It's not a bad thing. Shadowrun, eh? You want me to play Shadowrun on the Genesis? Oh my god! I play Shadowrun, but I've never played the SNES version. Why don't I play that one? Because I've played and beaten the Genesis version twice. This was in the past, of course. I agree, the Genesis one is good. Lots of herbs. Look how much money it costs just to heal. He says SNES Shadowrun is cool too, a lot different. Amazing music. Yeah, I'm I've never played it, but I have it behind me. <laughs> I got the case for the Genesis, but I don't know what happened to my game. I'm I'm missing some games. I think I may have sold them without selling the actual cases. This might have been years ago. I got no clue what I did with it. Yeah, damage increases. Okay. Yeah, like, like I'm missing Forgotten Worlds, Golden Axe, Shadowrun for the Genesis, and Aladdin for the Super Nintendo. Oh my god. Look at this fucker! You fucking asshole! Let me run! Piece of shit. Yeah, I've been trying to run the entire time. Asshole wanna let me. Nah, I'll just reload, man. I keep saving after, like, almost every battle. I need that one fucking RNG. I fucking hate RNG, man. In video games. It's horrible. I like chess. Yeah, the skeleton, huh? 
Dave says, so the heap has an ability that doesn't allow you to retreat. Oh, really? Ah. Hey, also, apparently there's an enemy. If I kill, I lose the smith. I was I was reading here. Uh, I'll tell you. Do you, like, do you know about this? It's called a, a bus sales. So B A S A I L Z bus sales. So yeah, apparently, if I kill it, I lose my blacksmith. Oh! Oh! Damn, he's gonna fucking die. He only took two shots. I can't beat this thing yet, man. Yeah, a heap of shit. Yeah, I got an idea. I got an idea. Oh my god. It says guy has to be fully healed. Yeah, right. Okay, fully healing him now. Yeah, you should be able to do three hits, right? He's gonna die, man. Okay. You know what I'm thinking? Hoping that the skeleton misses. says maybe you need to level up fucking hell i'm gonna i'm gonna beat this guy watch i'm gonna make him miss i'm gonna get some whack rng here says he has to have one more level in order to withstand the third hit <laughs> or the skeleton RNG misses me right can it happen we're about to see Does this guy have armor and shield? Yeah. Yeah, he does. Go to magical. Does it allow you to use herbs? Um, no. No. Um, you cannot use herbs in battle. I looked it up. You can't. guy. This is Lufia guy. Uh -huh. And he goes first. Can 
Can the Skelty even miss? This guy hasn't missed. Oh! Guy just missed. So it's possible, okay. So the skeleton can actually miss. Ah, oh, shit, whoops. My bad. I'm gonna save here. Since I'm doing some fuckery. So the save works, Dave. The, uh, the internal save works, and the save states work as well. It just didn't work with Shiny Force uh, Alternate. I'm gonna clap his cheeks. I'm gonna die, motherfucker. I'm gonna miss. That's how you're gonna die. Remember how I beat uh beat wizardry? I fucking save scum and like I save scum the fuck out of that game. And I was able to beat the last boss beat other level. Zool. Was it Zool or I think so, right? Or or am I thinking Ghostbusters here? Um, Dave says, have you done this? Stock up on 60 grand again and head back to Smitty Hamlet in Erex province to the south just before the desert. They will upgrade the Sword of Tauros for it. Really? No, I haven't done that. I could upgrade the Sword of Tauros, huh? So you said uh, Erex province. Uh, is it... It's a village called Swordsmith Village, right? 60 grand they kicked me out of the village I'm, I mean I'm pretty close okay, I'll try one more time and see if he misses that's a roadblock 60 grand but it's, it's not that big of a roadblock Okay, uh, let's go do it. Fuck it, heap. Heap of shit. Heap of dung. Barely hurts me. Okay, so let's get 60 grand and then let's let's spend all my money because I'm not using my money anywhere else except healing. Does heap of shit give me money? It says such a brutal enemy. Yeah. Because it's a piece of shit. Give me two fangs. It can go fuck itself. So I need to fight mad monks and the lions. Oh. Oh my god, that's two. That's two misses. Didn't avoid. I missed. Oh my god, that's three misses. Oh, no, no. Dave says, right, it's a joke, two fangs. Yeah, that enemy's a joke, besides for experience. Uh, yeah, we're not fighting this guy. Oh my god, what a, what a fucking cocksucker. Come 
Might as well use it up and get back to 20. Yeah, I'll fight here. You know why? Because there's lions here and I can get money. Um, <coughs> by, by the swordsmith town, there's one enemy that gives double the amount of money the lion does, like six grand, but they're pretty rare. At least, at least these guys here, guy, guys, uh, these lions are more prevalent. And I get three grand. When I kill five of them, I got enough money. Motherfucker. Did I just retreat? Dave says there are tons of monsters in the mountains that will give you tons of resources, but really tough. Uh, yeah, I don't know about that. There are a bunch of bums. Bum monsters living in the mountains. I can just grind here and where it's safe. I'll go beat up that skeleton. So what's the point of having mul like multiple allies if everybody attacks solo? Why not just have one character? This is literally Dragon Warrior. But your two characters are actually one character. I'll grind my experience. So I got good news. I don't have work tomorrow. So I could pull a late nighter here. It's just I'm not doing anything tomorrow. play the fuck out of this game. Is it these guys that give like 8 grand or 6 grand? I don't remember. No, it's not those motherfuckers. Ugh. Imagine making a modern RPG game where some enemies give money and some don't. It piss a lot of people off. Fourteen fucking pads. Lozenges. Before my throat. I desire to be healed, motherfucker. Even more healing.
Oh, this fuck, okay. Maybe I can beat it. Oh yeah, I wasn't able to beat it last time. Maybe I can beat it this time. I don't think so. Yeah, it's going first and it's not missing. We're gonna die. Oh, he used the fucking flame spells! Fucking shove it up your ass. Yeah, we can't even beat that guy. Oh, this dude barely hurts us. Barely. He's literally scratching the um, the hairs off of our legs. He's blowing dust on us. Six grand. Yeah, it's this guy. Okay. Oh, the Mad Monk. Dave says these guys give tons of guilders. Hell yeah! Whoop his ass! The Mad Monks are good too. They die in one hit. Dave says, so game to play Starflight on Genesis. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll check it out. says what I'll say right now Starfire is extremely difficult to beat. Is it RPG? Are you gonna make me play a game like Ghouls and Ghosts? So it's a different RPG, okay. Does it have a long learning curve? Big learning curve? Hey Sparta Uplight, what's up, what's up? What is this? This is called Miracle Warriors on the Sega Master System. Best way to explain it, it's like Dragon Warrior 1. So, um, gain levels, go heal in town, get weapons, fight bosses, rinse repeat, get characters. Yeah, this is Hello OG. It says, Starflight takes some learning, yeah, okay. Cool, that should be enough money. So I'm trying to get 60 grand now to go upgrade my weapon. There's a, there's a village here of uh, swordsmiths. This hamlet is a swordsmith village. What sword shall we fashion thee? That will be 60 grand, all your money. We await news of thy journey. Be not reckless. Oh shit, I did it. Look at this. This sword has been upgraded. Guy's mighty sword. Sparta Uplight says you will upgrade nothing and like it. <laughs> uh small upgrade, but uh, it may be enough to kill that stupid monster now. So, you see those bars there, okay, look at Zap's name there, and there's that long bar, right, and there's the bar, the first bar, this is the experience bar, and that second bar is his HP. Same as Guy. So you gain experience by hitting enemies, not killing them. Killing them also works, but by hitting them. Dave says, no go kick the now go kick the crap out of the skeleton. Hell, hell yeah. Yeah, guy's stronger. Spartan Alpha says it's like FF3. Uh, I've actually never played FF3. I do have it on the on the DS, 
One day I'll play it when I can stream DS games and 3DS games. I'll play it. But I've, I've beaten FF1, 2, 4, 5, 6, and 7. I've beaten all those. Nothing else. Out of the main FF numbers, right? Smart Hobbit says in FF3 you have to hit enemies so many times to level up weapons. <laughs> oh man, okay. I'll play it one day. So in this game, there's no ins, okay? You go at the healer, and the healer heals you depending on how much life you need. So if I need more life to heal, it costs more money. And I got a cold here, that's why I sound like this. We're fighting a cold, it's almost done. Hey, that's some money. Finally, some money guy. I should go fight the skeleton. I gotta heal. I don't want to use my herbs. They're too... They're like super expensive, right? So I'd rather just fight some enemies. And... Up these ass enemies. So in this game too, uh, you're... Your equipment actually deteriorates. Except there's a catch. If you get this motherfucker in your team there, the dude with the hammer, he joins the party and he 100% repairs everything. Every single time. And that mad monk, if I talk to him, he hurts me. If I fight him, he kills me. So the best thing to do is retreat. Spark Hotline says I meant like FF2. Yeah, yeah, that's that's how it is, right? You would literally you would actually hit yourself to like increase your HP and like, increase your weapons, right? Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. People fucking hated that game, man, for that reason. Yeah. You can actually max out all three of your, of your dudes right at, right at the beginning. Like you can max them all out. It's insane. Oh, cool. That'll give me enough money. Perfect. Yeah, so, so you can just stay in battle. Hit your old guys. Heal your old guys. Hit, heal, hit, heal. Or you fight this like weak-ass goblin. Spider Hoppus says, loved it. My spells were straight kill shots. Yeah, I mean, it was fun back in the day, but I don't think I would play FF2 again. Just, like, I don't want to love... I don't want to level like that. Not on stream, man. Even this game, it takes a year to like level up. Maybe I'll play a raw hack of the game. Yeah. Let's go there. Spartalba says play Pixel Remastered. Uh, the issue is. That'd be on the PC. I can't stream PC games. I have it on PSP. I have it on GBA FF2. Those are the only two versions that I have, right? But yeah, Pixel Remaster looks cool. Okay, let's fight the skeleton. Yeah, so I've come back. I'm stronger than ever. He avoided guy's attack, really. I'm loading. Spartan Hoplite says that Pixel Remastered, you can set experience gain. Okay, cool. Do they have a bundle or something where, uh, where they have all six games? Oh yeah, look at that damage. Oh, he missed. Finally missed. How shall I save it? I think I got him because he fucking missed me. I'm gonna save. I'll chance it, guys. I'll fucking save. So if I attack first, he's dead. Oh, you fucking asshole! Suck on that. 
part. No, but it says makes grinding way easy. So the way that Pixel Re uh, Remastered has that option. Okay, that's good, man. Oh my god, look at this. No, 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 no. I ain't finding shit. So I am looking at a map here on my screen. So there is 13 there. And I think I get another character here. Oh my god, leave me alone. Yeah, Skeleton Gaming 4 Fangs. What a cocksucker. If thou needs a ship, 30 grand guilders. Or 30 guilders. Oh, really? Well, look at my money. I have 1600. I need 30 grand? Well, fuck me, right? Okay. Let's let's go back to grinding then. <sighs> okay, these guys give three grand. That's good. Let's keep fighting these guys. Oh my god, he missed. Oh my guy didn't miss. Good. Dave says monsters. In the deep sea ocean are good times. You can probably sell some fangs. Nah. I'll just fight, man. I'll keep the fangs. What's up with the lightning? Selling fangs would be worth it. Because I'm going to need more, right? For the castles? But I'll probably get more. Really? I missed. Can't believe it, I beat the skeleton, finally! Roadblock over. Okay, let's see how much I can get for fangs. I'll do as you say. up there though where are these fangs they all have the same brother forge master oh 50 bucks for a fang okay that's not bad Sold all my fangs for fifty grand. So I went to sell my fangs. It says I will buy fangs at fifty bucks a pop. The motherfucker didn't tell me I will buy all your fangs and give you fifty grand. So he took all my fangs, which is a type of currency in this. To uh, fangs are used to get really powerful weapons and armor so I need 300 of them to get really powerful weapons and armor so I thought hey I mean I'll probably sell 200 and I'll keep the rest no 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 it doesn't work like that he says yeah buddy sells all of them you're going to get tons more you can sell all no I ain't selling man I don't want to hit another roadblock where it's like oh you need 300 fangs to get this weapon yeah they'll fuck up I'll be able to kill these guys soon. I'll just make 30 grand the old way. Let's grind, yeah! Kill like 10 of these guys will give me 30 grand. 
plus uh, healing expenses. Basically, think of healing expenses like the uh, the American uh, healthcare system, where uh, you pay money when you go to the hospital, <laughs> which is pretty insane, right? Without the insurance part. So that's how the that's how the healthcare in this game is. Yeah, three grand a pop. I mean, if I get these guys to appear, they're pretty nice. Oh my god, I missed. I missed. Yeah, I didn't know that the Sega Master System had games like this, because I was saying it earlier, this, this game is pretty decent. Like, it's a good game. Oh man, come on. Let's go heal. Keeps dodging my attacks. The music is definitely cool. It's fast paced enough. Where everything does. Like, the screens go by fast. I like that. Dave says, check out some monsters in the mountains. I think there are some that give lots of guilders. Okay, why don't I do that? It says for 86, this game was way ahead of its time. Yeah. It came out after Dragon Warrior, right? Dragon Warrior set the, the way for JRPGs. Spartan Blight says I was playing Castlevania in 86. Oh, nice, man. I didn't play it in 86. Absolutely not. Played it later. I think I played it in 89 or, or like 90. Played it at uh, my my parents went to their friend's house and they had a kid and, and, and the kid had Castlevania. That's where I first played it. Well, let's find some mountains. Let's see. Where's some mountains here? There are mountains up north. Let's go up north. Oh my god. Ah. <sighs> It says Dragon Warrior came out at 86, this game 87. Okay. Yeah, because for one I know, Dragon Warrior was the first first RPG on uh, Nintendo slash Master System. So the mountains, uh. Oh my god, what the fuck is this? Yep. Takes forever, right? Money? Hey, eight grand, awesome. I'll save that, thank you. So if I kill him, I lose Charisma, which is a type of currency for villages. So we don't kill... We don't kill good people in the game. I mean, I'd love to, except I don't want to fuck myself over. I think I lose 10... 100 points? Get out of here! Oh, this guy. Great. I don't think I can be him. Yeah, I can't beat this guy. Let's try fighting at the forest. 
It says gonna wanna be at full health for monsters here. <laughs> yeah, let's let's go back to town and heal. Oh my god, I missed. Oh, he missed. Okay, that's good. Yeah, enemy hits. Eight fags. Yeah. Something else that sucks up the time in this game, like, you spend a lot of time doing is going into fucking villages every single time just to heal. In normal RPGs, you just hit the end. Heals everybody. I wonder if I can kill this guy. Uh, no, I can't. He's gonna kill me in like four hits. Oh my god, stop it. Give me some good monsters. One step and I'm already fighting. Look at this fucker. Imagine like going for a hike mountains and, and this motherfucker shows up. He'd be so dead. Oh my god, why the fuck are you missing? You don't miss when you're almost killing an enemy. Good, let the enemy miss. Only enemies should miss. 28 fucking fangs, yeah, 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 yeah. What's the point of fighting here? When I can just fight lions? Go all the way up there to get nothing. Oh my god. Ugh. Yeah, at least this guy gets 300 bucks. I'd have to fight 100 of those guys. A thousand bucks just to heal. Wow. Ah, yeah. That's a life, right? No money on these guys. They're poor.
Come on, come on. Look at this eye fucker. Oh, puts me to sleep? Man! These enemies are annoying. Yup! I'm sleeping! Oh, flame spell! Oh, I'll put you both to sleep! How about, how about I fucking just load the game again? <gasps> I saved by accident. Oh my god. Oh, scared the shit out of me. Let's go heal. I got no money! Still missing weak ass enemies. Finally, some money. These enemies don't run away. Imagine if these fuckers were running away as well. Oh my god. But anyways, I don't have to think about that. That's pointless. Think about what's in, what's ahead of me. Yeah, these fuckers. I give them no money. At least some experience. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Keep going first. It's like a thousand bucks to heal my guys. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm gonna take a quick break, guys. I'll be right back.
Okay, I'm back. Just have me some... Some uh, pepperoni sticks. Let's go back to that northern forest. Oh my god, I missed. This is the first enemy in the game. Finally, some money. Two grand. Take one step, battle, one step, battle, one step, battle. You know what I would love to do? I would love to see encounter rate percentage in all these games. Wouldn't that be amazing? If I knew the percentage, I mean, it wouldn't change anything, but it'd be nice to know. Two-thirds of the way there, get the ship. Really? Both my guys have been put to sleep. Oh, guy woke up. I was just gonna reload. Oh, is that how you're playing? Okay, you put me to sleep and you attack me. Uh-uh. I'm, I'm not playing this way. Yeah, that guy doesn't give anything. I think this guy actually gives some money. Last time? Yeah, it's eight grand, so I'm almost there. Obviously, I don't want just 30 grand, I want just a little bit over just so I can get. Good snack here. Nope. Dave says, gonna turn it in, though. Keep making miracles. <laughs> I'll see you around, Dave. Have a good one. I'll be back tomorrow at 6 p.m. Pacific. Cool, okay. There you go, I just got enough money. And both my guys are close to getting a level. 
Yep, have a great night, Dave. Got him. Nice. Okay, that's enough money. Cool, even more money. That's for our, for our uh, hospital bill. It's gonna be like 1500. And you know what? Let's buy some herbs too. Let's max out our herbs. Okay, we are all decked out. Got the door open, the front door. It's it's so nice. It's nice and cool. Ah, love it. Yeah, I'll fight this asshole just to get you some experience. This guy takes forever. It's a heap of shit. Oh! Takes one last attack on me. Two fangs. What a joke. Uh, yeah. Why don't we just retreat? Save. Okay, let's get this fucking shit. Ship Argo. Oh, like, isn't um, isn't that a Odysseus' ship? The, the Argos. It was Argos with an S, right? I'm I'm pretty sure from the Odyssey. We sail to Eratos. How do I... Where do I sail? Let's see, what does this guide say? The Argo ship can be used on light blue waters. Oh! Light blue waters means on the right side. Okay. So. I don't want to fight you. Get the fuck out of here. Really? Why right does my butt to hit the water? Okay. Look at this. I'm on a boat, but my guys are just like in the water. So I go straight east and I'll hit 21, 20, and 19. 21 is Iphis Monument. 20 is Trails Cave. Oh, there's Agronaut Village too. Remember where I upgraded my sword? 
northwest of that. And there is 19 is Iphis Village. Okay, so why don't we just try this out? Go to Iphis Village. Try fighting it. Wait, did I just miss? Oh, it fucking missed. Good. The guys are about to level up. Oh, uh, enemy went first, uh, nah, 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 that's why I say. That's more like it. 20 fangs, wow. Wow. Amazing. Okay, so... The village is southeast of here. Cool. Trade the not 50 fangs for a special stone? Sure. Stone of protection against magic. What is that? Oh, okay. Oh, cool! Look at that. I got the ship as an item. <laughs> and then, then why do, why do we buy a few of these? Cool. So I'm on this continent now, and there's 18. 18 is Sylvius Monument. There's another monument up north. Okay, so why don't we go check out that monument? Be nice, a village. Um, okay, so let's see if there's a village nearby. A 50. Yeah, 15 is a village. Okay, so let's let's hit that village. It's uh, southwest of here. If I can make it. Just gotta take a quick break here, guys, and we'll get back to this game.
I'm back. Okay. So, I just gotta reload here. Got my ass whooped. Dagon. It's called a Dagon. So, west. Eesh, huh? Ah, too bad. Go fuck And there it is. Good, it's an actual village. Awesome. Okay, so let's find this. Healer! Good! A grand. <laughs> and uh, let's talk to everybody in the village. Nope, I ain't selling you fucking fangs. You guys are assholes. Stone of Protection works on spells. Okay. Let's see so. This is a long prosperous port of Doris. Welcome. What can I do for you? Uh, yeah, I don't need any of that. I want to know where to get the next character. Thou get a magic mantle in the cavern? Uh, no, I haven't. There's a dancer. What shall we do? Spell? Wake giant? It won't work. Spell alone is not enough. Oh, okay. This must be where I get another character. This is 15 Doris Village. Um, okay, so... Okay, so... Where do I get the next character? Let me look it up. I mean... There's this town all the way northwest of the entire world, okay? I could go there, but I don't want to go there for nothing, right? Since I'm already here. So why don't I look it up? Warriors. How to get party members. Oh, there's... it's an RPG shrine, okay. Medi. Uh, Medi is a legendary woman warrior. Oh, how progressive. We got a female character. She can spear through the enemy, crushing attack. Uh, where do I get him, though? get the characters. Oh, awaken her from the slumber across the seas. Well, thanks a lot. That doesn't say anything. Guess I gotta look at the walkthrough. I, I don't want to do that. Looking to walk through. 
my god, these ads, man. Get these fucking things away from me. What the fuck kind of ad is that? It's just so huge. Okay, so... Medi, Medi, Medi. Where is Medi? Okay. So before you awaken Guy from his trance, test your strength. You can add Sampi in the mountains with the armor of Kronos. The armor of legend needed to unleash Medi. You don't have to be this powerful, but traveling through the game is much easier. To reach the cavern with the Sampi, head west. Armor of Kronos. Uh, however, whatever, whatever. Oh, well, shit. Where do I get this? A Fadas. A Fadas. Okay, where's a Fadas? Fadas Castle 8. Where is 8? Okay. Fadas Mountains. Uh, before you awaken, guy. Sempi. What is Sempi? Once you've acquired the Iris Axe and the Kronos. So I gotta get the Kronos armor. Okay. Beyond Oruk. Where's Oruk Village 4? Okay, Oruk Village. It's close to that dildo cavern, okay. So, will you tell me how to get these items? No, game won't tell you. Okay, so I'm I'm too far ahead in the game right now. So um, let's go back. At least I got the boat. I could explore some places which I wasn't in. Save. Okay, let's get out of here. Yeah, let's kill this thing. Gives a lot of money, right? Apparently I need the armor of Kronos to get the next girl. Medi. Oh cool, level up. Awesome. Might as well head to the village now. Holy heal. Yeah, these guys actually give some money too. There you go. I wonder if there's a max level. I hope not. This guy gives three... 6k, not 3k, 6k, okay. Okay, let's heal and then let's, let's be on our journey. Because when you level up, you don't get healed. You get all that health into 
empty HP. I can go straight up. Now... Okay, so... I can actually just go straight up since I can traverse, uh... Reverse, right? So, I can go straight up and then left. So north and then left. West. North and then west. Yeah, don't fight these guys. We're gonna get our third character, man. Whoops. Yeah, look at this. I could just traverse like that. And I'll kill the weak monsters that I come across. Might as well, right? Easy experience. Oh shit. Did I fight this thing? I should have. Good experience, man. of them at Walmart, pretty cheap too, instead of the corner store. Yeah, just four feet bangs, that's all. Oh my god. Guy's stronger, ugh. Fucking guy missed. Guy's got, deals more damage. Where'd you go first? Eight bangs, wow. Is in a town which prays to the god of the sea. Okay. There's a town where I can heal over here, yeah. Oh, why don't we try finding that that sweet good Pokemon? Maybe I can beat it. Okay, where is this healing box? So we're go if I go straight to the left, I should hit this village, okay? Straight west. Yeah, these guys don't even give any money, so I'm not fighting them. Time to reload. Yeah, no thanks. Kill this thing now. Flame spell, huh? okay. Oh my god. 
Yeah, I'm I'm not I'm not playing that, no way. These guys actually give good money. Did I miss again? Oh, no money. Oh, fuck. Let's go heal them. I don't want to spend the herbs unless I really have to. Because this is cheaper. It's more economical. Yeah, so I need the Kronos armor. My guys asleep as well. Oh my god. So it does sleep and and deals damage. Oh my god, look at that. Look at how fucking strong this thing is. Let's try fighting it. What if we kill it? Wow. Fucking missed. He'd be dead right now. Oh, good. You missed too. Good. Balance. Wow. No money. This is what I mean. Like, enemies that I don't know, there's no point in fighting them. So there's a village here. To sail the stormy seas, thou needs to use our fine ship. But to sail the ship, the blood of pirates must flow in thy veins. So I need another character. Okay. Hmm. So the Chronos armor. I don't know how to get the Chronos armor. Let's look it up. I thought maybe it'd be here. So Kronos Armor and Miracle Wars, that's that's what I'm looking at. <sighs> okay, so this region, you will encounter new enemies. One such enemy, Gurl, while is capable of doing a bit of damage to poorly armored characters, its attack is generally weak. Okay, so... They're talking about upgrading my sword, which I did. Now, if you are at a particularly high level and have 11 sacred nuts at your disposal, you may wish to attempt to collect the Kronos armor. I need 12. I need 11 sacred nuts. 
Note that it is difficult to do without the aid of staff of earthquakes. But it is per it, it is strong. If you are strong enough to per perform this step at this time, jump down to the town of Menos section below and follow the rest of the walkthrough. Town of Menos. So remember that uh, that that Pokemon Suicune? So apparently, I'm supposed to use the magic nuts on it. Okay, so I'm supposed to fight that thing. Okay. Well, that's been on my radar. Let's go heal. <sighs> I may be strong enough to kill it, because the last time I fought it, I believe I was two levels behind what I am now. And my sword hadn't been upgraded. Oh my god. Take one step in random encounter. Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh, for 16 fangs. Yeah, I thought there was a village here. Good. Now we'll go heal. Let's go fight Suicune. I want to see if I can even beat it. It's in that cave there. Oh, cool, okay. I arrived to it with full life, okay. Sempi. <laughs> Looks like a Suicune, man. Maybe strong enough, yeah. Ah, uh, that flame spell. If if not, I'll have to get those items that the game was telling me to get. Cool music, right? Yeah, I don't think I could beat him, man. Even if I were to gain another level... It means I could probably take two or three more hits. Yeah, there's no way I could beat it, see? Uh, okay. So what do I need? How do, how do I get those nuts? As long as you have obtained the Toro Sword and Guy from the Kingdom, you already extended Exploration South. Without ship, you only have one option, the bridge. 
However, when you set foot on this bridge, you're immediately set upon a skeleton. Yeah, I beat him. When you, when you arrive on the opposite shore, you will begin to encounter new sets of monsters. Like, Minos Torif does not contain anything in particular beyond a healer. Also, like, Minos Torif merely a base to help you reach the next destination. Would you Karn? Okay, so, Village of Karme. Okay. It's a remote southern village. Um, and a bit of west of Torif. While you can travel west first to locate the bridge of Karme. You have a boat, so crossing rivers is no longer a problem. Instead, follow the plains. Okay. Inside of the village is a man that will sell you earthquake staffs. You are only permitted to stock up to four. You have 40, 40 grand. You're advised to purchase four of them for the next step. Okay. So, let's go back there and let's get the four staffs. Okay. So what village is this? Karma. Let me look up where Karma is. It's probably far away from where I am. Yeah, it's <laughs> it's like straight south of the world. Okay. So you know where like sweet good is? Yeah, it's it's like right there. Okay, so I need 40 grand. Remember where I was earlier? When I where I traversed the water? I need to go back there because uh, there's monsters there that, that I should give good money. But that's what I'll do, okay? Yeah, I ain't fighting any of these guys. Fight this guy. That's money. Forty grand, huh? Then I'll have to get the nuts, the magic nuts. Halfway there. So I can't go in the dark blue. Okay. What the fuck is this? There is defense, okay. So level ups do give defense. Not every enemy does the same amount of damage. Three grand, okay, that's good. So what village is this? 18, is this 18? No, this looks like Torrid Village. 14, okay. So I think I'm actually really close. If I go to the right, it's the village where I could actually heal, right? So let's go east. There should be a... Okay, so there's a cave there. I got no clue. Oh! This is where I got the ship. Okay. Okay. Wonder if this thing gives money. Oh, 
It's one of those. Oh man, come on. I'm not fighting sleeping enemies. They just cancel out your attacks. These guys actually give uh, six grand, which is great. The battles actually kind of remind me of Fantasy Star One. It's the same console, right? Oh man, come on, you fucking missed. No, you dodged it, okay. Eight grand, okay. So we almost got enough. Yeah, I'll fight these guys, they give actually money. Okay. Yeah, three grand is three grand, right? Let's see where I am now. Yeah, I know exactly where I am. Now, if I go, if I go down, there should be a village. Yeah. Oh, an actual village where I can heal. Oh, amazing. Okay. Let's explore this village. So I'm really close to the Earthquake Staff Village where I need 40 grand. I just bought some herbs there. Guess I had 15, right? everybody great storms rage across areas adios no areos areos okay art thou the long awaited miracle warriors uh, yeah sure Take me with you, I'll only hinder you. What? What does that mean? Can I take that dude with me? Okay. So, we just gotta fight here. And you know what? Let's throw out a save. Good. These guys give good experience. Or uh, good money. <laughs> Not actual useless monsters, right? Yeah, six grand. Okay. So we got enough. Okay. Let's go buy this thing. If I go straight down, a little bit to the west, should be there. Let's save just in case. There it is. Okay. Cool. I will gladly fight you. You guys actually give me money. Some 
Yes, extra money, okay. Your donation of 10 grand. Heal their screen stuff. Okay, so I could only get four of these. Okay, so I got four. Now, now the guide again, right? <laughs> so walk in the Medi. Your next destination, Medi, located in the cluster of caves. Okay, so I need the 11 sacred nuts. I don't even know how to get those. So I'm just reading here, trying to find where I get this, the sacred nuts. It doesn't tell me where I get the sacred nuts. Let's see. Miracle Warrior Shrine. Why don't I look there? Miracle Warriors. Not just trying to figure all this out when playing this when it first came out. Fuck me, man. What the hell is this? Just ads? Item drop from a Lifant. The weakest of the magical attack items, but still essential for all boss battles. So, Lifant. Where are Lifants? Bestiary. Oh, it's alphabetical. That is wonderful. Where the fuck are the Lifants? I've never even seen this thing. Because they're in forests. Okay. Hey, where are the Lifants? Where are Lifants? Miracle Warriors. Let's see, Lifant, Lifant, Lifant. Oh, oh, okay. Lifant, where are the Lifants? Oh, okay, okay, so battling. Forest Lifants will sometimes heal secret nuts. Lifants will drop carry a maximum of 11 nuts. Lifants don't always drop them, um, but this is the best spot for the game, even better than Aruka's province. Okay, let's go. Okay, you will reach Oruk. Oruk. So where is over four? Mask of the Beast. There's a weapon smith for hire. Further south is Ortigian Forest.
so you know... Okay. Okay, it's actually not that far, it's like in the middle of the map. Okay, if it's not forced, if there's lift hands in that forest, we'll go, okay. Let's do this. There. Save. Let's do it. You may see north of here. Come on, man. Oh, wow, they are. They're actually strong. Yeah, I'll fight this thing. Yeah, to beat that uh, Suicune Pokemon, normally I probably have to gain two more levels. It's like, instead of doing that, I could just do this quest, it'll be quicker. the water there should be a forest Dagon not a dragon but a Dagon oh my This fucking forest. Save. Should be Lifants in here. Town up north where I could heal. Oh, 20 fangs, that's it? Really? here guy will start at one level below you don't go crazy since there is a maximum starting level oh okay. Yeah, this is the forest that seems like it is. Oh my god. We have to fight this guy. Keep 
drawing. Hey, there is Lifans. Okay, okay, I found him finally. They're elephants. A sacred nut. Hurl it at an enemy when attacking. That's what I need. What I fucking need? Sacred nuts? Oh my god. Oh, I get three per battle. Okay. So I just gotta kill like four of these guys. That's it. And we'll go beat up Suicune and then we'll get we'll get the girl. this. Oh my god. <laughs> so just gotta kill three more of those guys. Oh my god. Just, yeah, just load. There we go. Okay. Save. Two more. I gotta kill two more of those guys. Oh my god, why did you mess? load until I, I randomly encounter this Olifant. I actually don't mind encountering these guys. They are the best form of revenue in the game. Because they die in one hit, right? And they give 2k each time. 2k money. Give me a fucking lift up. Easy kill. Some experience. Yes! One more after this. Oh my god. Come on, man. <sighs> okay. I'm gonna kill one more.
One Fang. What a piece of shit, One Fang. I wonder if I can fight this guy. I'm not quite there. Like, two more levels probably I could beat him. Talk to it. Talk to it, and it's like, yikes, it's attacking. Finally. Yay, we did it. So, I, I could only have 11 nuts. It means I can't get three more. Okay, that's annoying. Oh, hold on a sec. Where is this village? One sec, guys. Southeast, southwest of here. Let's seal and then we'll go fight that sweet goon. Finally, oh, I wanted to kill that fucking thing for a long time. Kill. So just west of here. And there it is. Shall I try fighting this thing? Yeah, we could probably kill it. Hopefully it's got money. Okay, that works. No, I could not. Come on, man. Took one fucking step. Okay. Let's heal and go fight this boss. one of those nuts. I think so. Well, let's see if this is enough. I don't, like, I don't even know what to do with him. Just use him in battle or something? Okay. 
there it is. Not attack me. Oh, is this why the nuts are so good? The only issue is I'm not getting any experience. Hopefully, that's enough. Spell. Fuck me, man. So that shit. Stop that. Cast any more spells. Oh my god. Almost got him. Three, like three more. Oh. Okay. What about the earthquake stops? Like, what did those do? Check it out. Man, this fucking game is nuts. Okay, you will get it. Be attacked. Sempies are the guardians of the legendary armor. They are quite strong. The first strategy should be to use all your magic items. Okay, so I have to use the, the staffs. That's fine. Let's just reload. Nut. I'm about to nut on you, sweet goon. I'm a nut all over you. What a dumb item to attack with a sacred nut. Does give experience. Okay, that's actually pretty decent. Then. Yeah. So, staff, is that it? Back with staff of earthquakes. Okay. Cool. I guess this is how you cheese. Yeah, I got one more. I don't, I don't need to use it. You can just kill him. Oh my god, I missed.
Oh my god. Three flame spells in a row. Four flame spells in a row. We got him though, he's dead. Fuck you, son of a bitch! Oh my god, I missed again. Little bitch! Ooh, 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 ooh. Fuck you up. Toronto <laughs> Sarma, we got it. Zaf has put on the armor of Kronos. He was he's wearing it. Okay, we got it. Now, where the fuck is the girl? After collecting the Kronos armor, go to Eratos. We'll find a time called Doran. Okay, now go to Doran. Okay, so Doran, we can get the girl. As with Gaia, it is wise to purchase armor and shield for Medi, but you can refrain from buying a weapon for her. Okay, so where am I going again? Doran, okay. We're going to Doran, and we're going to get the girl. Where is Doran? Let me look this up. Doris, you mean? Doris Village? It's one of those south villages. I mean, I did talk to the... I did talk to the person to... Wake up. Wake up the girl, right? Yeah, so I think I'm gonna go all the way south now. No thanks. So main dude is baller now. He's so thick. Main dude is thickest dude. Save. Okay, now I pretty much go here and then south. South, okay. Oh my god, I missed. Nice, I will always take these guys. guy of course he misses yeah it's one hit with that let's just retreat I'm 
about fighting that thing. Nope. Okay, I'm on the south continent now. Now... It's probably the village southeast of here. Here, yeah, it's, it's across. Good. And down there, so should be here. Where get the girl? Let's try fighting this thing. Oh my God! Really? You got flame spells as well. Holy shit! Better be worth it, two-headed dragon. That that enemy looks great, by the way. Miss me. Five grand. Okay, that's not bad. Yeah. Let's find the healer. Oh my god! Just go left. Holy shit. Mantle in the cavern, no. Could be the wrong town. Spell. Hey, it worked! Yes! We got our chick. Chick member. I am Medi. Here is my portion of the scroll. Our final companion has been changed. To a beast by the black monk black monk those motherfuckers oh my god okay so so okay I'm just gonna use the guide from now on man armor Look at that! I got three dudes with me! That's amazing! Okay, awesome, awesome. I was gonna see, did the, the map music change? Okay, so save. Now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna read the guide. Let's fuck this game, that's why. <laughs> Medi's legendary weapon. With Medi, now your party, in your party you can visit the kingdom of Eratos. Oh, okay, it's in a castle, okay. Well, I got tons of things. Let's find where Eratos is. Elatos. So Elatos Castle is 17. 17 is actually um, west of here. It's not that far off. I'm gonna save again just in case. I'm gonna save over here too. Now we're gonna go get our sword. Oh my god, I just retreated from you, really?
Sassel again. I should just save after every, every retreat. Okay, uh, yeah. So I'm even closer now. Hey! Medichick, you wanna, you wanna kill that dude? Good job, whoop his ass. That's it. Welcome, how fare thee on thy quest? Medi, let this sword serve thee in battle. Master it, at the earth will aid thee. Eros' sword, it holds great power. Oh my god! God, oh, this is so good. This, this is beyond good. Okay, we got Eros as well. Now, where the hell do I go? <laughs> okay. Now. Medi's armor. Moments after obtaining Eros' sword, you're ready to gather Medi's special armor. It will consist to fight another, another Suicune. Pokemon. When you're prepared, head east of the town of Torif. Okay, so 14. East of Torif, okay. East of Torif, above the desert, past the monument, follow the path between the forest. Oh, okay, okay, I see it, I see it. It says boss four. Yeah, okay. So, we need to go uh, grind a little bit now, okay? So we gotta grind a little bit. Why don't we do that? Mm. Items. I need... I need staffs, so I need a lot of money. And let's fight these guys. Let's attack with Medi. Let her gain some experience. I can't just press up and go to Medi. Like you know in Pac-Man when you go left, it goes right. When you pass the screen. I can't do that. I can't press up. Whatever, let's heal. Oh, this is good. Isn't this guy like six grand? Yeah, I'll just fight here because battles just give me money. Instead of other places where battles are very specific, very low percentage of having monsters that get money. did an attack there that actually made a sound. Interesting. Yeah, tonight's gonna be a long one, guys. Again, I, d I don't work tomorrow, so there's no point in making this a short stream night. Oh my god. Okay, let's fight it. Because the Sassel gives money too. Oh my god. It's pretty good. I wonder if they have unlimited flame spells. That's pretty fucking strong.
Five grand is five grand, man. Oh, I got enough. Cool. Let's go. Well, after the ceiling, I'm not sure. <laughs> Oh, just enough. Okay. This is a good spot to grind money, actually. Ah, <sighs> well, shit. Do I really need those nuts? Can I beat the Suicune without the nuts? Why don't I try? It would save a lot of... dumbass grinding, right? Cool, cool. Yes, give me the money. So the village is here. So... These items are just to uh, beat bosses. They make your life easier on, on bosses, that's it. Okay, now, how far is this place? Can I just go there? It's actually not that far. There's, uh,. There's no village nearby, so this is the closest village, so I wonder if, yeah, I wonder if these stats will be enough. And I can just use my characters, right? Since I got Medi as well, Medi can just do some damage. I may need the, I mean, I may need the nuts, I don't know, we'll see. These are some of the best enemies actually to fight. They got lots of HP. They don't counterattack much damage, right? That's right, also I could get more herbs now. Pretty good. Easy money. That's the money, I don't care. So, how far is it from here? Okay, it's literally like a few steps to the right. Yeah, here it is, okay. But now let's... Let's heal. Medi's nimble fingers open the lock. Here it is, okay. So, magical staff. Yeah, we may be able to beat it. Guy, do the job. Ouch. Man, this music is so good. Oh, if he keeps doing spells, I can't beat him.
But if he keeps doing that, I could beat him. Fucking hell. Then he's gonna be useless here. Oh my god, he keeps casting spells. Come on, guy. Guy's my strongest attacker, so that's why I'm doing this. Wow, that's a lot of spells. I think I can beat him if he doesn't do enough spells like this. Oh, you avoided the attack too? Oh my god. Come on, me, dude. Yeah, I, I don't think I can beat him. That's too many of those spells. If he only did the attacks, I'd be able to beat him. Okay, let's go to the forest, guys. Oh my god. This fucking... It's, uh, it's like north... west of... Not bad, not bad. He's a good enemy to kill. So we're gonna fight those stupid elephants, we're gonna get the sacred nuts, and do all that bullshit again. She gives a lot of money. I like how they didn't even fucking put a boat in the game. <laughs> They're like, fuck that. We're not putting a boat. That's all you get. Oh my god. What a douchebag. Go to, go to left? Yeah, that's it. Okay, here's the fucking elephants. Hey, Infinite Metal! We got a raid in, guys! We got a raid here going on. Infinite Metal. Thank you very much, Infinite Metal. Welcome, raiders and viewers. How is it going? My name is Afris and Tuxas, and I'm playing a Sega Master System game here on original hardware, right? Yo, Infinite Metal, thank you so much for the raid. And your Raiders. So I'll tell you guys a little bit about myself. I am... Um, I'm an old dude. <laughs> I play RPGs. Uh, I play other games too. And I only use uh, real uh, hardware. Right? And I try to get the best, best images for my hardware too, right? So uh, I'm currently playing uh, a Sega Saturn game called Dragon Force. And I'm playing... This game here called Miracle Warriors on the Sega Master System, which I never even heard of until recently. A buddy of mine was like, yo, play this game, play this game, right? So I'm playing it right now. It's pretty, right? Thank you for the follow, Pixel Junkie. Welcome aboard. From Infinite Metal to my channel. Welcome aboard. I stream also uh, Monday to Thursday, 6 p.m. Pacific, right? So you can always catch me then. And, uh, yeah. Um, I stream also... I've done, like, Castlevania games. I love that series. Uh, obviously the Metroidvanias, but uh, I also love the uh, side-scroller platformer ones. I've streamed those on my channel. I've streamed uh, Mega Man games. Did a uh, what did I do? I did a 360 game a while ago. I did Splatterhouse on the 360. <laughs> that was nuts, man. That's one gory game, right? And uh, I'm I'm Canadian. <laughs> I'm from Canada. I love above you Americans, right? Besides that. So that's that. Again, I'm uh, playing this on the Sega Master System, so I have a Mega Drive. Uh, what is it called? Mega EverDrive Flash Card. So that's how I'm playing this. So if you see, if you see me doing save state, it's actually on real hardware, right? So I don't own this game. 
it's on the uh, Sega Master System. So this is the second Master System game I'm playing here. I've streamed. I've also done Master of Darkness. I did that on Halloween. It was pretty great. Um, Infinite Mail says, Canon does not real. You can't fool me. Yeah, yeah, we don't exist, right? We're actually from Minnesota, eh? And then we got the, the Minnesota accent, right? Nexus Rift says, hey, y'all got good bacon. Uh, yeah, it's all right. Need to take Justin Bieber back, though. We don't want him. You could have him. I remember the Iron Sheik on Twitter was like going nuts on Justin Bieber and wanted to like whoop his ass and shit. Rest in peace, Iron Sheik, right? Uh, Pixel Junkie asks, do you drown everything in maple syrup though? Uh, not really. I don't eat much maple syrup. But it's it's all over our stores, right? My son doesn't like it as much. Uh, like, he doesn't like it. He likes regular pancake syrup. He's like a pancake connoisseur. So this game here, it's sort of like Dragon Warrior, okay? It's very similar to Dragon Warrior. And I'm trying to find these guys. So I'm trying to get this at this battle where they, I get three sacred nuts. And I need those sacred nuts to kill the boss, right? This is an older game. It's, it's very, uh, very cryptic. I've been using a guide and a map. Yep. Sacred nuts, guys. I'll show you. I'll show you the status screen. There you go. I got some sacred nuts. Okay. So, here is the status screen. The top one is my main dude. Then there's Guy. Then there's Medi. So, before I got a weaponsmith in my party, the items were like in Diablo, so they have durability and they broke down, right? So, I had to repair them. Now I don't have to anymore. Nexus Rift asks, can we find those this time of the year? The Sacred Nuts? If you search long enough, you gotta apparently find these elephant guys. And they got the Sacred Nuts. So if I try to retreat from a battle, I may not always be able to. And I'll get attacked. Everybody in the team gets attacked. So you see those white bars there besides Zaf's name there's two bars the top bar is your experience meter the bottom one the longest one is your HP okay so every character has that so in battle only one character can attack at a time and get counterattack back how you gain experience is by hitting the enemies you don't get it by killing enemies by hitting them it's a very archaic game, but um, I was kind of enjoying it. Uh, like before this, I played uh, Vandal Hearts on the PlayStation, which I'm actually really enjoying the PlayStation library. And afterwards, I tried this game. Because I played another game, Carthia. It's like a strategy RPG. The PlayStation Man, that game was shit. I was telling myself, this game is better than a PlayStation game, you know? So I'm going to keep saving. I'm playing this on a, like an OG Genesis controller. The three button one. Yeah. Man, Dragon Force is so good. Ugh. If you guys have played, uh, if you haven't played Dragon Force, but you played Ogre Battle, it's sort of like Ogre Battle. It's a strategy RPG, but it focuses a lot on the macro aspect of uh, army management, which I actually really enjoy in, in video games. Besides the battling part, like I really enjoy the uh, macro of building armies, and and it's almost like uh, singly building RPG characters, right? So this monk here, I gotta retreat, I can't, can't fight him. He'll whoop my ass. What game were you playing, Infinite Metal? I know you probably finished Breath of Fire 3. Infinite Metal says Breath of Fire 2 tonight, just started the stream. Okay, cool, cool. Which version of Breath of Fire 2, the SNES or the GBA? 
I got the SNES one behind me, actually. Infinite Metal says, I did Breath of Fire. One, three, five, now I went back. Okay, very cool. Already done one. Infinite Metal says, SNES through the Switch. Never had a real copy. Okay. Wish I had a Switch, man. But I'm not willing to spend that money. I'd rather... I'd rather spend, like, the money that I would spend on a Switch. I'd rather get my NES RGB modded. That's my next goal. So, for you guys that don't know RGB modding, it's, uh, it's basically, um, HDMI has RGB uh, component does. SCART does. So, those, uh, those wires with the blue, green, and red, plus the audio jacks, right? That's, that's RGB. So, like, PlayStation 2 has that. Uh, what else has that? Uh, ESP has it, right? So the NES, the highest capability it's got, it's uh, composite. Which I mean, it, it kind of looks like shit. So I'm gonna get mine RGB modded, right? That's that's my next uh, big expenditure. Infinite Metal says, so legal copy but no card. Yeah, that is totally legal. Digital games are absolutely legal, but I mean... People, people play like emulators, and I'm all for emulators, man. Video game preservation. Plus, who's got all that money to spend on video games, right? I, I gotta go fight more elephants there. Yeah, this game might be uh, very prehistoric for you guys. <laughs> it came out in uh, 87, apparently. And again, I didn't know anything about this game until like a month ago, until my buddy went, Yo, you should play Miracle Warriors. I got a cold here, that's why I sound like this. Or the end phase of a cold. Are you seeing this random encounter rate? Every step I take, holy shit, man. Okay, there's a town here. So I'm gonna go heal again. The middle says, oh man, that's a theme of the night. Random encounters? Yeah, uh, I think Breath of Fire 2 is worse than Breath of Fire 1. For random encounters. What spell do you get when you uh, when you save the kid from the cockroaches? What spell do you get from Ray? If it Mel says Breath of Fire 2 SNES copy is pretty bad with the random, random encounters. Yeah, it's the worst of the series in that sense. Really? Breath of Fire 2 is the worst? Oh man. It's, it's such a good game too. Okay, let's just save here. So Ray gives you Cure or Revive, but it's like a half ass Revive, which doesn't always work. If Mel says, Renew, I usually try for, and I put it on Ryu since he'll be in the party for all times. Does, does Ryu normally learn Cure? Renew is nice on Nina, but I don't think I don't think Nina learns it. She's got all that MP. Okay, Infinite Metal says he has cure. He's healer. Okay, good, good. Yeah, yeah. I think I think I actually got cure on Nina because I found out that through all my playing that Renew kind of sucks. Finamel says, Nina is attack magic in Breath of Fire 2 onward in the series. Right, but outside of battle, she can cure. If, if you give her a cure, there we go. More secret nuts. Finamel says, yeah, Renew has only 70% 70 70 chance of working, which is great outside of battle, but in battle, man, when you keep missing that Renew, it's pretty rough. But yeah, cure on Nina is actually pretty damn dope. But for the final party, 
So I'll tell you my final party for, for Breath of Fire 2. It's the most like overpowered retarded party. Um, obviously main, main guy, I use Bow, uh, Dark Light, Shaman, I use Ran, Earth and uh, I don't remember if it was like water or whatever, fire. And I use, um, I use blue. So then I don't have to fuck with the shamans. So yeah, uh, blue blue gets so powerful. The more you level her up, the, the more powerful she gets. She'll like overpass Ryu, right? She's not like in Breath of Fire 1. Ryu is just... Ryu is great in that game, Breath of Fire 2, but... Blue is just so crazy. I found Nina... Nina to be one of the weakest characters. Even Stan. Or or Jean. The frog. If you give him shamans, he's amazing. With Stan, the problem is... Um, if you give him shamans... You, like, like, you can't bring him in the last fight. Because you need to... Uh, grab the pole with him, right? Infinite Mouse says... She also has huge growth rate in one as well okay blue does that blue in general is op from the start really yeah which i guess makes sense since she's basically a legendary warrior trying to wake up yeah uh, i like to imagine her like uh immortal right like an immortal elf you know like a to uh, token elf just goes stronger as they age that's blue right Yeah, it's, I mean, it's kind of cheap using blue, because then you have uh, Ryu and blue that don't, oh nice, elephant. Then you have blue and, um, Ryu, right? In the team that doing shamans. But also gives you an opening to uh, use some uh, insane shaman mixing, right? I like Spar. Spar was kind of like the jack of all trades. He also has cure, which is awesome. So what I gotta do here? I gotta use one of these items, these sacred nuts. If anyone else says, "Yep," though she gets weaker again when asleep for a few centuries. Otherwise, she potentially just take on the big bads herself. Spar, you can get his Morph Fusion first, which is nice. Yeah. Yeah, he becomes like the mushroom girl. And then he's, what does he have? He's got the seed mushroom girl, and he's got like he's got that uh, dragon plant thing, right? So he's pretty flexible with the shamans. Yeah, man. But Jean, Jean sucks normally, right? Except when you fusion him into his like uh, armored frog form. Oh man, he's so good. Infinite Mouse says, I do like having Stance Fusion plus Nina for Infinity Deal. Because Nina can use Holy, which several major enemies are weak against, so you can clean up. Yeah, but Sten, you can only give Sten the uh, Fire Shaman, right? If if you give him like Fire and Wind, he can't, uh, he can't use his Overworld Map ability anymore. Unless there's something I totally missed. So, so you can't bring him into in, into infinity, right? Stan, holy fused, nice. Okay, so let's use one of these nuts. Now let's kill him. Yeah, I mean Nina's good. It's just she's not good early on because. She only has so much MP. And... Her, her attack just sucks. Utterly sucks. It's useless, right? At least every other character can attack and, and heal at the same time or cast magic, right? Even Blue. Blue can attack for like a lot of damage. The more you level her up. If it Mel says he only needs that to get some special equipment so it's a trade-off I think but it's so it's been a while since I've done it yeah I don't think you can bring Stan to infinity which which really sucked because his 
His full, like, shaman form is really good. And it's the one that you get, uh, it's like one of the early ones that you get, too. Okay, so now we're gonna go fight a boss. This boss here kind of looks like uh, the Pokemon Suicune, you know, the legendary, the legendary dog in Pokemon Gold and Silver. So I've been using a guide here. Okay. And we're gonna go south. And then east. It's such a good game though. In uh, Breath of Fire 1, uh, since it's a Capcom game, there is a... Oh man, come on. There's a cameo with Chun-Li, right? From Street Fighter 2. Let's see. Yeah, a couple in one. And Breath of Fire 2 has... Uh, I think it's got like Karn, Bow, and I think it's got those two in the on the giant isle. So I'll use some herbs to heal. Infinite Metal says you can find her with a special sequence in the Thief Down. Yeah, Chan Li in the Thief Down in uh, Breath of Fire One, and in the secret ending. That is super obscure. I don't think I've seen the secret ending. You're the only one who's told me about it. And I played that game for years. Infinite Metal says, "Yeah, Capcom like throwing references in those games to their other ones." Yeah, exactly right. It's sort of like in um, with Konami games. Uh, if you have a save file of, I didn't know this. But I was told about this, right? I've never played Metal Gear Solid on the PlayStation, but if you have a save game of Sukuden in your memory card, and you play Metal Gear and get to a specific boss, he'll say how you have a save game of Sukuden, since they're both Konami games, right? Yeah, I believe this is the boss here. Yeah, that's the boss, okay. Let's see. Pinmo says, there's stuff in that game people are basically still finding decades later. I keep noticing different stuff. But the secret ending is almost identical to the good ending. There's basically no way, at least in English, to know how to do it too. <laughs> Except for probably a strategy guy, right? This boss here is going to be pretty crazy. Save. Okay. Magic nut. I'm going to nut on this Suicune. Listen to this music. It's just killer music, man. So when I use the magic nut... These items here, the nut and the staff, is strictly fight enemies. When you use it, the enemy does not attack back, right? So you can keep dealing damage. I'm guessing when I meet the last boss, this is how I'm going to beat the last boss. I'm going to magically nut on the enemy. I'm still getting experience from it, right? One day I will play Breath of Fire 3. It's just so many so many streamers that I know have played Breath of Fire 3. I want to tell myself, you know what? I don't want to copy them. I don't want to play Breath of Fire 3. I'm going to play some weird, obscure fucking game that nobody's ever heard of. Oh man, okay. I'm in nut on him again. Okay, so I've used up all the nuts. 
No, I don't want to use the staffs. I wonder if I can kill him without this by attacking him. Infinite Metal says, yeah. Breath of Fire 3 is still the most popular in the series, I think, and generally most liked. Nice, nice. But I'll never get to play 4 because I don't have 4. I believe I have... Is 5 on the PS2? I think I have 5. Infinite Metal says, that said, it's not really that popular, just more popular in our niche. Okay, so I do have five. Okay, I got, I got one, two, three, and five. I don't have four. On the on the PS One, I'm missing some like big hitters. I'm missing like Breath of Fire Four. I'm missing Sukuden Two. It's always gonna haunt me because I never buy those games. They're too expensive. Oh my god. This is a real boss, man. Look at this. Flame spell. Oh, man. Infinite Mail says, I only have Breath of Fire 4 on the PS3 PSM. Okay, okay. And that's that's gone, right? That's down right now. I know Xbox 360 is done. Infinite Mail says, but I hate it. It's a lot of people's favorite in the series. I hate it. <laughs> Fair enough. I've never tried it. I just heard that it was really good. Oh my god. Look at how strong this Pokemon is. Infinite Mail says, since I, it's already downloaded, I still have the game, presumably. Yeah, yeah, that's, that's how it works, because um, I do have a PS3. I haven't played it much, but I played a, a lot of uh, Xbox 360 in that era. Oh my god. Whooping my ass. Okay, so we gotta use a spell. The, uh, the staff here. Yeah, I gotta cheese him. Gotta get done. Okay, so I got the armor of Athena. Medi has put on the Arth armor of Athena. Athena, uh, goddess of warfare and wisdom, right? One of the 12 OG pantheon gods. Cool. Okay. Now, let's go west and let's heal without dying. If I die, I'll just reload. I've been same scumming the fuck out of this game because I don't want to deal with it. Also, when you play uh, Breath of Fire, right, you get a, a, an East crowd watching you. I experienced that with Shiny Force games when I played Dragon Quest VIII. It's like a niche crowd that only come for that game, right? I get it especially with Shiny Force. It's like the Shiny Force crowd literally only watches people play Shiny Force on Twitch and Kick. It's, it's insane, yeah. Because, yeah, everybody's pretty much left <laughs> from your raid. I do appreciate your raid. I knew it was going to happen. Because I was thinking, I'm like, Breath of Fire. It's, it's probably a niche crowd. It happened, too, with, like, when I was playing, like, Shining Force. I had, like, 20 viewers. The only fucking watch Shining Force. Infinite Metal says, I was kind of that way for Breath of Fire games before I started streaming. You watch, uh, you watch other streamers, right? The only people that I watch is basically um, people that I raid, because I don't, I don't watch people stream. I don't enjoy it much. I like chatting with people a lot more. There's a town here, perfect. What I do enjoy when I watch him, uh, I basically watch like Mike Matei, because he's such a fucking rager. He's actually pretty entertaining. Besides that, I'll watch, like, speedrunners. I find that entertaining.
Get fully healed now. Now. I'm gonna save. Since I got a wicked ass armor here, I'll show you guys my armor. Armor of Athena. Infinite says, right, I like hanging out, chatting, but I get involved with people playing Breath of Fire sometimes. Just don't see it often. Fair enough. Yeah. Also happened with like Dragon Quest 8. When I played that man, I had this like niche crowd. They only came for Dragon Quest. Because I raided the guy back who uh, who came and then we chatted. And he was playing fucking Dragon Quest 8. Like, <laughs> this crowd loves Dragon Quest 8 so much. They will watch other people play it. And they will play it themselves. For me, I can't do that, man. I can't, I can't fucking... When I, when I play a game and I'm done with it, I don't want to see it again. Maybe Medieval 2 Total War. That's one game I can't get enough of. Okay, so... I'm not gonna look at the map. I'm gonna I'm gonna look at the guide here, and I got a guide I use on my phone. If anyone says, yeah, that's why some people basically dedicate to one specific game too. That's crazy, man. One specific game. What I like about Medieval 2 Total War is that the games are different every single time I play it. It's always different. Then there's different factions, right? Okay, so optional stones of protection. Before you continue and yet another senpai fight, you may wish to obtain an item that can make senpai fights slightly easier to survive from the cave of Phrixos. Okay, enter the village and you, you can exchange 50 fangs for stones of protection. Using these stones has the ability to block enemy spells for the remainder of the fight. You may fail, you can but use the stones until it succeeds or you run out. You can hold a maximum of six. Purchase all that you can carry. The guy's legendary armor. So we got another Suicune fight. Oh my god. Okay, so where is this one? So village of Kadmos. Kadmos. So where is this village? I'll tell you where it is on the map. Kadmos. The most of Ka. <laughs> um, 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 um. Apparently they use different pronunciation because I don't see Kadmos village. Most village, uh, well, fuck. Is it 19? I don't know, man. I have no clue what the fuck this is. Okay, Infinite Metal, have a great one. Thank you so much for the raid, and I will see you around, bro. You have a great night. Wasn't there sacred stones east of here? Let's see. Yeah, I'm getting close to there. Let's fight it. My guys have almost gained a level, actually. Come on, Medi. Kill that monster. Kill it good. Gain that level, Medi. Yeah, it'd be cool if she actually gained a level. I know she's close. Eight grand.
Oh, okay. This. Yeah, 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 yeah. I thought so. So these are the uh, special stones. You get for 50 times each. Okay. Now where's this other boss? Boss number five. So, okay, okay, let's see. Fight number three. I think it's boss number three, guys. Okay, I know where this is. Remember where I got the boat? There's a cave there. That's where I gotta go. Okay, let's do it. Let's fucking do it. Fucking avoiding my attacks. Oh, my God. Three. I'm gonna go try to get those nuts again. The magical nuts. Uh, should be right on the left here. Right on the left. <laughs> should be west of here. That's what I should be saying. Oh, hold on. What is this? Oh, I see where I am. Okay, uh, I'm close, actually. Very close. Very, very close. God, what the hell is this? Probably close to killing this guy. The mad monk, yo. Actually, let's, let's pump up Medi. If I can, that would be good. Save. Okay, we just healed everybody. Let's go kill some of those elephant dudes. Come on, man. What are you missing? Oh, he missed. Good, good. Yeah, I missed. He's supposed to gain a level. Nice. So many opens the caves. Remember, I encountered those caves earlier, where they they were uh, they had a secret seal, like like a closed door. So many opens those. Nice, beautiful, and she's about to gain a level. Yeah, I'll just use her and then catch her up to everybody else, right? Crushing attack, are you seeing this? She's the only one who's done criticals. I've never seen any anybody else do criticals. Okay, so she's caught up in level, not in experience. Oh, nice. Beautiful. Nice. 
That's it. Wow. Okay, let's use one nut. Nut all over the elephant. And use Medi. Okay, cool. Okay, let's go fight this dog. just level up everybody else. Yeah, I'm just gonna level up everybody else. We'll beat this other, the other Suicune Pokemon. It's not too uh, far off as well, it's just at the bottom. So if I go south, I meet the enemy there. Good, I'm getting tons of money. I don't think I'll need the staffs, man. I think once I level everybody up, I should be strong enough. To beat these sweet goods the old fashioned way. Man, it's gonna take forever to level up. It's like a small bar, but it's really not. At least I'm getting tons of money, right? Should have been grinding money here early on. I'm getting hungry. I'm gonna probably call in a night after I beat the Pokemon Suicune. Level up, guy and main dude. Ugh, takes forever, right?
Uh, he needs two more pixels. <laughs> Maybe two more now. One more pixel. Oh my god, so main dude's gonna need tons. God damn. This might do it. Nope. That did it. Missed? I mean, I got 80 grand now. That's uh, that's really really good. Probably get more of those staffs, but I don't think I'll need it. items. Wonder what S and D are. Missing? I was. I'll stock up on herbs since I'm so stinking rich. Oh God. Come on, <laughs> give me the stinking level up already. It's almost a bad thing being so strong for leveling up. up a weak enemy and getting experience. I'm two pixels away from a, a level up. God damn it! Give me my level up! Yeah, one pixel. <laughs> this fucking game. Yeah, don't attack this motherfucker. I'm 
Come on, one more enemy? How many more enemies is this? Oh my god, finally. Finally! Hold on a sec, since I'm sticking and rich, I'm not going to be a cheap mouse. Healing for everybody. Let's see how much money it costs. 600. 1,140 dollars. Let's get the herbs. I know I could hold like 30 herbs. Oh, only 20? That's weird. Thought I'd be able to hold 30. Okay. So. I go south, I guess. Yeah, right there. Medi's nimble fingers open the law. Here we go, an another Pokemon. Let's nut all over him. Okay, so I'm gonna use all my nuts. Then I'll fight him normally. I've used all my nuts? Okay. Stop some news, a magical stone. Get it. It don't work. Stop the enemy spells. Okay, so let's let's fucking let's whoop his ass. Is this stronger? I'm fine with this. If he's not casting any spells, I'll beat his ass. Come on, Medi. Whoop his ass. Yeah, we got this. That's actually a nice item that can't cast spells. Oh wow, critical. Yeah, Medi's the only one who's done critical attacks. Did she do it? Nice. Oh yeah, she's got this. She's got it. Beautiful, okay. I got the Titan Armor. Guy has put on the Titan Armor. <gasps> Ah, oh, <laughs> that's so good. Okay, what is what is next? I'm about to call in a night here. But what is next? Upgrade Medi's weapon. Oh, really? Okay. Final step for you at this point is to return to the village west of the town of Minos. West. Of Minos. So where's Minos? Let's see. Minos is 11. Oh, the 
weaponsmith down, okay. Um, Gilders to have the weapon, smith upgrade, Medi's weapon, we don't have the money saved up. Were your equipment boosted? It's time to explore a monument. Okay, okay. Yeah, damn, that's good. Get out of here. Come mean dude cannot get his weapon upgraded. It's 60 grand, so most of my money's gonna go. I saw she hit up that town on the west there. Perfect, okay. Let's heal. Wow. So expensive. Okay. Oh my god, I took one fucking step. Okay, this hamlet is a swordsmith village. What sort of sword? Oh, I can even pump up. Oh, what? I can pump up me and dude's sword. We could not forge this sword any finer. I didn't know that I had to pump up me and dude's sword. Oh, man. Well, I will be doing that then. Look at this. Oh, ha, ha. Okay, so, guys, I'm going to call it a night here. I am way too beat. Plus, everybody's left. <laughs> they got sick and tired of watching this Sega Master System uh, gem here. Save. Quit. Save. Yeah, I'm gonna call it a night, and I'll be back tomorrow, 6 p.m. Pacific. You guys can catch me then. Same place, same time, same planet. Have a great one, guys. Peace out.